so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika! Whoa! <laughs> I'm up so high! Hello! I'm over Hello. here! Hello! Oh, there's a slide! I'll meet you at the bottom. Hi! <gasps> Three, two, one! Yay! <laughs> Hi, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Twinkle Play Space in Brooklyn, New York. I'm so excited because there's lots of fun things to do here. Oh, look down here. This looks like something a doctor would use. Maybe to check your reflexes? Whoa! <laughs> I'll just put this in my jam pack. And a thermometer. Something else a doctor might use. Interesting. Hmm, a clipboard? Maybe a doctor clipboard? And a stethoscope. Yeah, this is something a doctor uses to check your heartbeat. <laughs> There's a note. Dear Mika, Pettenville needs someone to take care of its animal friends. Here is your veterinarian kit. I know you'll do a great job. Signed, Mayor Rooster. Oh, that's so cool. I get to take care of animals. That's what a veterinarian or a vet does. They're so important because they're animal doctors who take care of animals. Oh, look over here. A doctor's coat. Let's try it on. Wow, I look like a real animal doctor, huh? <laughs> oh, first on the list is a dragon. We better go find it. Come on. Whoa, check it out. A really big, cool looking dragon. Hi, dragon. Oh, it's a mama dragon. Look at the four dragon babies up there. Let's see what the problem is. I'm Dr. Mika. What's the problem? Hey, I can't laugh. What? You can't laugh? Oh, that must be so frustrating. I love to laugh. Hmm, let me see if I can help. Let me just check your heartbeat. Dun dun, dun dun, dun dun, dun dun. Ooh, I like that beat. Heartbeat sounds nice and strong. Hmm, what are some ways you can make someone laugh? Maybe some silly dance moves. Uh, okay, Mama Dragon, check this out. Nothing? Tough crowd. Hmm, well, maybe there's something wrong with your throat. I'll take these scarves, we'll go in here, up the dragon's throat, and out. Maybe that will tickle the dragon and the dragon can laugh. Let's try. Mika. Oh, well, thank you for being a wonderful patient. <laughs> wow, we did it. Thank you so much for your help. <laughs> Have fun laughing. Okay, next animal. Come on. Wow, what a beautiful tree. <gasps> Look, cute little birds. Hi, I'm Dr. Mika. How are you feeling today? Oh, they said they feel fine, but they need their checkup. Have you ever been to the doctor for a checkup? Yeah, just to make sure everything is good and nice and healthy. Come here, little bird. Oh, so sweet. Tweet, 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 tweet. <laughs> okay, the first thing I'm gonna do is check your temperature. 
Okay, let's see. I think I have a thermometer in here. Yep, here it is. Just gonna put it under your wing. Stay still for me. Mm -hmm. Yes, perfect temperature. That's really good. Okay, let's see what else we can check here. How about your eyes? Look at me. Keep going. Look, there we go. All right. <gasps> nice. Ooh, healthy eyes. You must eat a lot of healthy food. All right, now we're just gonna check your brother over here. What healthy birds we have here. Keep up the good work, eat healthy and stay strong. Tweet, tweet, tweet. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. This is a vet's office. Animals can come here to get some extra care if maybe they're not feeling well or they're sick. Oh, look. This is a cool place to give an animal a bath, make it nice and clean. Oh, these are bird cages. Cool. Oh, don't see any birds in there though. Hmm. <gasps> I do see some animals over here. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Look at this little kitty cat. It's sleeping. Shh. <laughs> oh, this cat's awake. Hi, cat. Do you want to come out and say hi? Oh, meow, meow. Oh, how are you feeling? Much better. Oh, I'm so happy. Do you want to rest a little longer? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll put you back. Okay. Oh, there you go. Have a nice rest. <laughs> Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, it's a horse. Yay! Nay! Hi, horse. I'm Dr. Mika. How are you feeling today? Much better. Nay! Oh, good. <laughs> I'll put you back so you can rest too. Aww. <gasps> Another sleeping animal. It's a little puppy. Look at its little nose. So cute. Did you know that dogs can smell really well? Yeah, they have wet noses. Have you ever noticed a dog's nose? If you touch it, it feels a little wet. Because smells stick better to wet noses than dry noses. And a dog could smell a human over 40 feet away, or about 12 meters. That's really, really far away. Isn't that cool? Oh, isn't that cool? <laughs> oh, do you know what animal this is? It's a rabbit. <laughs> Look at its long ears. Hello? <laughs> oh, I think this rabbit needs to rest too. There you go. Aw, all these animals are resting. It's really important to rest, especially if you don't feel very well. And look, a little pig. Oink, oink, oink. <laughs> look how cute. How are you feeling today, pig? Oh, that's great. The pig said it's feeling a lot better. Oh, good, I'm so glad. Well, everyone rest up, and I'm going to go look for some other animals who might need my care. You come with me? Let's go. Cool. We're on a farm. Wow, there's lots of farm animals in here. Huh. A chicken and little chicks. Hi. <laughs> They're so cute. <gasps> Three new patients. Let's see. Hi, I'm Dr. Mika. How are you? <coughs> oh, <laughs> I understand, cow. The cow is saying that it's feeling a little lonely. Aw. Well, <laughs> looks like your x-ray is on the wall. Let's take a check. All right, looks like, uh-huh, correct. Yep, that's the one. Oh yeah, you look great. Your x-ray is actually perfect. But you said you're lonely. Hmm, you know, they say that cows have best friends. <laughs> yeah, they have a favorite cow that they like to hang out with all the time. So I bet you need a cow friend. Hmm, do you see any cows around here? Meow. Did you hear that? I think it's coming from inside. 
Oh yeah! <gasps> Look at this sweet cow! Girl. Do you want a best friend? Girl. I have a great friend for you. Come on! Here you are! Best friends, best friends! Aww! <laughs> Do you feel better? <laughs> awesome, I'm so glad. Did you hear that? It sounded like a cat in trouble. <laughs> oh no, there's a cat stuck way up there. I have to save it, come on. Whoa, a fire truck. Ah, yeah, firefighters help cats get out of really high places all the time. Looks like I need to save a cat. Here we go. I'm coming for you, cat! Hi, cat! It's me, Dr. Mika! Let me see if I can get you unstuck. Oh, are you okay? Oh, well, I have you now. Let's go back down the ladder. How are you feeling? Oh, <gasps> there's a fire! I better become a firefighter and put it out. Close one. You know what? I think I'll take you to the vet's office and check your heartbeat and make sure you're A-OK. -okay. Come on. Meow. <laughs> OK, little cat. Welcome to my office. Let me just give your heartbeat one more listen, OK? All right. Make sure it's a nice, strong heartbeat. OK, let's listen. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, sounds perfect. <laughs> nice, strong heartbeat. Okay, well, you've had a really long day, so I think maybe you should get some rest. What do you think? Yeah, I agree. Come on, let's see if there's any open spots for you to lay down and take it easy. All right, here you go. Get nice and cozy and take a little rest. It's important to get rest, especially when you're not feeling well. <laughs> well, I had so much fun today taking care of those animals. Thank you so much for your help. And isn't it cool that dogs can smell so well and that cows have best friends? <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Awesome. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, I'll see you next time. Mika the Vet, out. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Hi, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at the Gingerbread Factory in Leavenworth, Washington. This place is so cool because they're known for making gingerbread. Have you ever had a gingerbread cookie before? Oh, they're so yummy! And I love it when they have icing on them. I wanna know how icing is made, and I bet I can find out in here. Come on! <gasps> Whoa, look at all of these delicious looking desserts! Hmm, but that's not the icing I'm talking about. Oh, look at these cookies, yum! You don't have any icing on them. Hmm, let's keep it. Whoa, <laughs> look how big that cinnamon roll is. Ooh, and that has yummy icing on it. And these cookies, they're shaped like hearts. Oh, they're so cute. I really like this pink one with rainbow sprinkles. That's the kind of icing I wanna make. <laughs> Hello. Hello there. I'm Mika, what's your name? I'm Ashley. Oh, nice to meet you, Ashley. You too. Are you a baker? I sure am. Oh, so I bet you know how to make icing. The sugary good stuff? Yes, that's my favorite. I sure do, do you wanna know how to? Yes, please. All right, come with me. Oh, awesome, let's go. I'm so excited. Okay. So before we get to creating in the kitchen, we've gotta wash our hands. Oh yeah, okay. let's get our hands clean. So excited to make icing. Okay, so first things first, get some soap. Wash my hands. It's important to have clean hands when you're baking or cooking. 
so you don't get any germs in the ingredients. Keep everything nice and clean. All right. Whoa, that's a lot of I don't know what. <laughs> yeah, so friend, this is 10 pounds of powdered sugar. The first ingredient to making icing. That's a ton of sugar. Yeah. Do you want to dump it in the bowl so we can get started? Oh, sure. Okay. Oh, do I need to wear anything special? Oh, you're so right. We're going to have our apron. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Okay, this way we can keep all of the messes off of our clothes. Mm, so right. Okay, so the first thing is gonna be the powdered sugar in this big bowl. Oh yeah. Okay. Whoa. Oh, it's heavy. Good Whoa. job. Looks like snow. Whoa. <laughs> Perfect. Look at this. Yeah. Now it's snowing in the kitchen. <laughs> There's still some more, there's more. Mm-hmm. All right. Oh, sorry for the mess, Ashley. Oh, you look <laughs> great. The next ingredient is meringue powder. Whoa, what is that for? That's to make the sugar whip together into icing. Whoa, okay. Maybe this will make such a big mess. Mm. Oh no, that was much better. Yeah. <laughs> Last but not least, we need the water to liquefy it. Oh, okay, the whole thing? The whole thing. Some water. Yeah. This is gonna make a lot of icing. Mm-hmm. And so I don't have a poof on me. <laughs> We're gonna have you mix that up till it's nice and liquidy. Whoa! You need some big muscles to mix all this icing together. <laughs> Oh, I can smell it. It smells really sweet. Mm hmm Round and round, get all the ingredients together. Okay, is that good? I think that's looking pretty good. Okay. All right. <laughs> Want to give that a little ting-ting? Okay, a little... A couple of tings. Uh -huh. <laughs> Two more. Okay. All right. Now I'm going to put this guy onto our lovely machine, and we're gonna get to mixing until it's nice and wet. Wow, okay. Yeah. Wow. This machine is so cool. And so helpful. Yeah, it's gonna mix everything together to make a really nice, smooth icing. Mm-hmm. Because grandma's before had to do it all by hand. Wow. One, two, three. Whoa! It's so cool! Come look! Woo! <laughs> okay, I cleaned up a little bit. Now I'm really ready to make some icing. Just in time, it just got done. Oh, yes! Yeah, so actually, you want to learn how to make a decorating poem? Yeah, that sounds so cool. All right, awesome. I'm so glad to hear that. So we got this bowl. Okay. All right, and there's a spoon already in there. Do you want to scoop Ooh. a couple of heaping spoonfuls Ooh, out? Heaping, heaping. Yeah. That means big. Okay. Oh. Whoa. Yeah. Look at that. Some more in there. Mm -hmm. Wow, we need a lot of icing. Okay. Whoa. Perfect. Nice and fluffy. Mm -hmm. Look at that. <laughs> okay. Okay. So next, you're going to take one of these bags. Okay. And you're going to fold it so we can hold it without getting our hands fold dirty. Fold it so you can hold it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Now what? Perfect. You're going to hold it just like a cup. And here's your tip. Oh, thank you. This is what helps us push the icing through. Oh. And we're gonna slide it right on in, all right. the way to the bottom. That perfect. Now you're gonna take your spoon and just put a couple of spoonfuls in there. <laughs> Not right. too much. Oh no, I'm gonna get messy again. <laughs> it's okay. It's fun to get messy. Woo! <laughs> all right. Nice catch. Thank you. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Should I start squeezing it down? Push it down just a little. Push it down just a little. With it still folded? Fold it up. Okay. Fold it yeah. up. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. 
Perfect. I'm gonna steal some too, so we're on the same page. You shoot down, yeah. you see it? And I'm gonna do just a little. How's oh, that? did great. Yeah. So to make sure it doesn't all come out the top, mm -hmm. we have these lovely little clips. Oh, yeah. so you can fold it down. Fold it up. Fold it up. And around. Oh. Yeah, and then we push down. Push, push, push. Oh, perfect. Okay. Here's your lovely little clip. Thank you. Here's my lovely little clip, and we clip it on. Awesome, we're ready That's... to decorate now. All right, let's do it. Let's go. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, look at all of this. I see candy. We could decorate with candy. And oh, there's so many different kinds of cookies. Wow, look at this. A little person. It's so cute. And oh, do you know what color this is? It's one of my favorites. Purple. It's a purple rectangle. And oh, look at this really bright circle. It's orange. <laughs> Ooh, and here's one of my other favorite colors. Do you know what it is? Yellow. Nice. Kind of looks like a sunshine. And a blue square. Look at that. These colors are so bright and cool. And there's little circles. Look, they can be eyeballs. <laughs> All right, what should I decorate first? Hmm. Ashley, what do you think? Oh, well, if you don't want to use white, I made all these extra colors for you. You did? I did. Wow. I see purple and yellow yeah. and blue. Wow. Okay, let's see. I think I'm going to make a little person. <laughs> Maybe I'll use purple because I love it so much. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna do a purple shirt. And yellow pants. And maybe some white curly hair. <laughs> and let's see. I'm gonna do a blue face. Eyes and a smile. <laughs> it kinda looks like my grandma. <laughs> Yummy. Woo! And maybe I'll decorate this one with a big yellow. See if you know what this is. It's the letter M for Mika. <laughs> oh, this is so fun. And it really makes it easier to decorate in these bags. Makes it easier to write things. You know who this is? Huh? <laughs> That's right, it's me, Mika! <laughs> this is so much fun decorating these cookies. Oh, hey, hey Ashley! Hey friend. Hey. How'd you like decorating today? Oh, I love it, it's so much fun. And I made you a little something. Oh. I'm getting pretty good at decorating. Do you know who this is? It's you. That's right, and I made it just for you. Wow, thank you. You're welcome, and I also made, do you know? It's Blippi. <laughs> That's right, my best friend Blippi. I made this for you too. <gasps> thank you so much. Well, thank you oh. so much for teaching me how to make icing. Anytime, friend. Oh, I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs> wow, this has been so cool learning how to 
bake icing and how to decorate cookies? Look! Hello! Hello! We're best friends! <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Great! M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Cake Bash Studio in Lake Balboa, California. They have so many fun cakes to decorate here. And maybe I'll get to do some decorating of my own. Come on. Whoa, check out all these delicious treats. Hmm, I wonder what they all are. Oh, hey, look at this treat right here. That's called Tres Leches. Oh, and look, don't these look delicious? Those are cake pops. They kind of look like balloons. <laughs> Can you pretend to hold a balloon and float away? Ooh, wow. <laughs> oh, and check out this. Do you know the shape? That's right, it's a square. Hmm, do you know what fruit this is made out of? <laughs> yeah, it's a lemon bar made out of lemons. Whoa, so many delicious things here. Yum, look at these cakes. Oh, I really like how they're decorated. Look, do you know what kind of animal that is? <laughs> That's right, it's a bunny rabbit. Let's pretend to be bunny rabbits. Huff, 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 huff. <laughs> Whoa, it looks like maybe they had a little bit too much carrot cake. <laughs> oh, and look at this one. Oh, it looks lovely. Do you see the shapes on this cake? Do you know what it is? <laughs> yeah, they're hearts, just like this one. <laughs> All right. I'm supposed to be decorating cakes too. Oh, I see someone over there. Maybe they can help me decorate a cake like this one. Come on, let's go. Hey, I'm Mika, nice to meet you. Hi, nice to meet you. My name is Moretis, how can I assist you? Moretis, I would love to decorate a cake. Oh, you came to the perfect place. <laughs> That's what we do. So any idea you may have, we can turn it into a cake. Hmm, I'm not sure how I want to decorate my cake yet. Mm, well, we have plenty of inspiration. So Ooh. take some time to look around and I'll meet you in the back so we can get started. Great. All right. <laughs> okay, let's take a look. Whoa, look at all these cakes. Hmm. They're all different sizes and they're decorated differently too. Time to get some inspiration. Inspiration is when you're getting ideas that make you want to create. <laughs> Let's check out these cakes. <gasps> Whoa, look, a unicorn cake with a beautiful rainbow on it. <laughs> so colorful. And check it out. Wow, this is called fondant and you can use it to create all kinds of different shapes on cakes like clouds and flowers and different shapes. <laughs> Uh-oh, it looks like rain. Oh, showers. <laughs> Let me get my umbrella. <laughs> so cute. Did you know that you can't have a rainbow without rain? Uh-huh, that's right. And look over here. These cakes, they all have different toppers. This is called a topper because it's at the top of the cake. Oh, and there's a rabbit topper and a topper with a word. Do you know what this says? <laughs> it says love. Let's spell it. L-O-V-E, -E, love. <laughs> oh, and check it out. The bunny rabbit has a little heart nose. <laughs> oh, I got an idea. Let's turn on this radio and have a 10 second dance party. Ready? Bloop, 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 bloop. I love cake, cake is great. I love cake, cause it makes me wanna wiggle and shake. <laughs> okay, I feel all inspired and I'm ready to decorate. Let's go. <laughs> Hello again. Oh, hi Mika. Did you get any inspiration? Yes, I have a lot of great ideas. Awesome, so here 
we're gonna get some embellishments that you can add to your cake. And after that, you're gonna meet me at the cake decorating station, okay? Great. <laughs> but first, let's grab your apron. Whoa. Baker and Mika. Thank you. <laughs> cool, I have an apron. I'm Baker Mika, ready to decorate. <laughs> First, let me tie my apron up. Check out all these embellishments. Embellishments are little details you can add to a cake. Whoa, and look, there are so many different types of colors and shapes. Hmm, I'd like to put this on my cake. <laughs> Do you know what these are? <laughs> yeah, bananas. Mmm, they're yellow, just like one of my favorite colors. Okay. Oh, speaking of favorite colors, purple. <laughs> yeah, my other favorite color. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, I should get out some embellishments of Blippi's favorite colors. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I need blue and orange. Oh, check it out. Blue and orange. What do we have here? <gasps> some pumpkins. Oh, and lots of blue sprinkles. Do you hear that? That's such a cool sound. It's like a maraca. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I like to decorate cakes. <laughs> so cool. Okay, let's grab some more. Hmm. Oh, look at this. Kind of look like mermaid tails. Cool. I'd like some of those, please. And check it out. These are metallic. <laughs> some of those. And, hmm. Oh, look. This kind of looks like snow. <laughs> That's pretty neat, too. I just washed my hands. I have my embellishments, and I'm ready to start. Awesome, so now we're gonna work in some fondant. Okay. Okay, so we can create some decorations for the cake. Great. You're gonna take the amount of fondant you wanna use, roll it so you can smooth it out. Okay. And then you're gonna roll. Roll it? Yes. Kinda like a ball. Hey, I could even juggle with these. <laughs> there you go, your rolling Ooh, pin. My rolling pin. Now I'm gonna roll it out. So it's nice and smooth and flat. Yeah, one smooth Ooh. motion. <laughs> Thank you. It's kind of like clay. Okay. All right, you're ready. So now you're gonna choose your cutter. Huh, I'd like to choose this flower. You Place gonna that there. press it and wiggle. Press and wiggle. Now can I pull away this extra yes. fondant? Okay, let's pull this part away. Check it out. A beautiful flower. Ooh, maybe it's a daisy. Maybe it's a sunflower or a rose. Great, we'll put it right there. Can I make one out of blue fondant now? Of course. So now, roll it. Roll it up just like a ball. Move it out. What's this? Cornstarch. This helps you for it to, for the fondant to not stick to the surface. Oh, okay. Good to know. Now you're ready to roll. Ready to roll. <laughs> Ooh, I like this color blue. How's that? All right, I think that's good. Okay, so now what shape are you gonna use? Hmm, let's do a car. <laughs> So now remember, press and wiggle, wiggle. Press and wiggle. Great! Oh, that looks awesome! Oh, I just remembered. I have some cutters in my jam pack. Oh, awesome. Let's do those. I have a bow tie for my best friend, Blippi. <laughs> and, oh, a T-Rex! Rawr! Can you roar with me like a T-Rex? <gasps> roar! You too. <laughs> roar! <laughs> okay, I wanna do the T-Rex next. All right. 
There you go. <laughs> a blue T-Rex. That is funny. Ooh. Hello, T-Rex. We can see his bones and everything. All right. That looks great. Could be a bow tie or a hair bow. Okay, I'd like to finish with this truck. Honk, honk. This out, it this out. <laughs> there you go. And here we can use that. Oh yeah. Things to see it didn't cut through completely. You can cut it out. Perfect. There. there you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, let's wheel you over, truck. Honk. Honk honk. Alright, so now that we're done with fondant, we're gonna be working with frosting. This is our American buttercream, and we have our food coloring. These are primary colors. Yellow red, and blue. When you mix certain primary colors, you make secondary colors, like purple and orange. <gasps> oh, I've got it. I'd like to make purple and orange. All right, so let's do it. Okay, let's scoop in our frosting. All right, so in order to make orange, I'd like to mix yellow and red. Perfect. Now to make purple, I will mix <gasps> red and blue. There we go. Okay, time to stir. Wow, it's turning orange. It's turning purple. <laughs> Great. That looks delicious. All right, so here's your cake. Now you have everything you need so that you can make your creation. If you need anything else, just let me know. I'll be in the back. Thank you. All right, you're very welcome. Bye, Marini. Bye, it's nice to meet you. <laughs> okay, let's start to decorate. Woo, I'm excited. Okay, gonna put on my truck. Let's put on our car next. Oh, and look at this. It's a turntable. <laughs> Spin, spin, spin. Oh, I want to put my flower on top. Hmm, where should my T-Rex go? Rawr. Oh, here's a great spot for it. Hmm, I'll save my bow tie for later. Now I'm ready to do some frosting. Oh, look at that, it's so pretty. Wow, three little ringlets. Let's do a little fourth one. Wow. Okay, let's put on some embellishments. Bananas. Open this up. Whoa, check it out. Sprinkle these on top. Wow. Okay, let me put on the bow. <laughs> check it out. We did it, we did it. We never ever quit it. We did it, <laughs> yeah. Wow, awesome. We decorated a cake. Whoa! Decorating cakes is fun and creative too. First, we got inspiration. Then, we cut shapes into the fondant. And then we frosted our friendship cake. <laughs> yeah! Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika! Okay, friend. I'll see ya later. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at the Children's Creativity Museum in San Francisco, California. Do you know what creativity is? It's when you use your imagination to make anything. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Mexican 
control. I'm ready to explore! Whoa, smooth landing! <laughs> Did you see? I was a rocket ship! <laughs> hey, look at these cool blocks! They're so colorful! Oh, and they feel soft! <laughs> Do you know what shape this is? This is a rectangle. See? There's two short sides and two long sides. Yeah, do you know what color it is? Green, that's right. And look at all the little circles. Huh, these are really cool. Ooh, one of my favorite colors. Yellow. Hey, what if we built a rocket ship out of these blocks? All right, let's do it. Maybe this one and this one. Mm-hmm. And we need some wings. Which block would make a good wing? <gasps> this one. And maybe this one. Hmm. Maybe some yellow on the top. Yellow, it's nice and bright. This way, space knows we're coming. <laughs> and then maybe this. Whoa. Yes. It's time to launch this rocket ship into space. Count down with me from 10, ready? 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Blast off! <gasps> We've landed in space. There's no gravity. This is why I'm walking like this. Floating because I'm astronaut Mika. Whoa. One small step for inspiration. One giant leap for creativity. <laughs> Whoa. Look at all these moon rocks. You have to hop over them. Will you hop with me? Okay. Nice hopping. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. There's more to create. Let's go! Creativity installed. Whoa! It says launch it. You must be able to launch things here. Huh. <gasps> this is a vertical wind tunnel. Yeah, this wind down here forces things to go up through the tunnel. This is a great way to test gravity. Do you know what gravity is? It's the force that pulls everything on Earth to the ground. It's also what keeps the planets orbiting the sun. Without gravity, they would just be floating around in space like, like this. Whoa! Whoa! Where's gravity? <laughs> hey, looks like there's some items here that we could test to see which ones will float up through the tunnel. It's time for sink or fly! Let's see. Hmm. Oh, look. There's some leaves and flowers. They look really light. Do you think that they'll float up through the tunnel? Only one way to find out. Ready? Three, two, one. Three, two, one. It went all the way up out of the tunnel and here it comes. Ooh, ooh. I caught it. I'm gonna see if it'll go up again. Okay. Ready? Goodbye, little leaf. Whoa, that's so cool. What else is in here? Oh. Look at the squishy ball. <laughs> I wonder if this will float up the tunnel. What do you think? It's a little heavier than the leaf. All right, let's try. Three, two, one. Nope. <laughs> I think it's too heavy. Oh, look, there's some cotton balls here. See, they're green and soft. They also feel pretty light. Should we try? Maybe we can try both of them at the same time. <laughs> Ready? Three, two, one. Whoa. 
It didn't fly up, but did you see it twirling around? Let's try again. Whoop, nope. <laughs> All right. <gasps> hey, this kind of looks like my bow. Twins. <laughs> this is pretty light too. Do you think it's gonna go up the tunnel? Let's try. <gasps> oh, just went up a little bit. Let's try it again. <gasps> Whoa, that was so cool. What about this? Ooh, this is so pretty. This piece of fabric, yeah. It looks light and floaty. Let's see what happens. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna let go, ready? Three, two, one. <gasps> Can I catch it? Got it, that was a fun one. I wanna do it again. <gasps> Three, two, one. Blast off! Wow, so it seems like the items that are really light go straight up out of the tunnel. And then the items that are kind of heavy stay towards the bottom or they don't float at all. What about this streamer? You might see this at a birthday party as a decoration, but have you seen a streamer in a vertical wind tunnel? Whew. Ooh, ready, set, go! Whoa, can I catch it? Can I catch it? Got it. <laughs> Gravity is so awesome. Should we pretend to walk like there's no gravity? Okay, let's go. Whoa. 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 There's no gravity. <laughs> huh. I wonder what's going on with this wall. I see some tubes and pipes and this looks like a track and oh look there's a magnet on this side and it sticks to the wall because it's magnetic cool i have a great idea let's make a comet run do you know what a comet is it's made of frozen space dust and rock and ice, and the closer it is to the sun, the faster it travels because of gravity. So, we could say that this ball is the sun. Ooh, so hot, it's hot. Okay, sun, you stay there. And now, I need to make a comet run. So I'm gonna move some of these pieces so that the ball can travel towards the sun. So let's see, make this down like this. What do you think? All right, now, which ball should be the comet? <gasps> what about this one? One of my favorite colors, purple. Okay, do you wanna be the comet? Great. Okay, you got this. You have to travel so fast towards the sun. You ready? All right, three, two, one, go! Whoa, that was amazing! Did you see how fast it traveled? Let's try another one. Maybe this yellow one. One of my other favorite colors. <laughs> okay, focus on the sun and travel as fast as you can. You got this, three, two, one, go! Whoa! Oh, that one fell off. Maybe we should try the purple one again. All right. There's the sun. Travel so, so fast. Three, two, one, go! Yeah! That was amazing! This calls for a 10 second dance party. Dance it out with me! Hey, let's go explore some more. Whoa, they even have a space up on the rooftop outside where you can be creative. 
Look at all of this art. <laughs> Whoa, these are doors. Hello. <laughs> they painted them. Oh, look, a little green squiggly line and someone painted a heart. Oh, cool. Whoa, this structure kind of reminds me of a rocket ship. Three, two, one, blast off! Hey, they have a smock. That means that I could paint something. Yeah, it's good to wear a smock. Then you can protect your clothes from the paint. <laughs> I'm feeling so inspired. What should I paint? Maybe something in space? I will paint. <gasps> Maybe you can guess. Do you know what planet we live on? Yeah, Earth. So I'm going to use, you know this color? Blue, yeah, blue, like the sky, the ocean. Whoa, I'll make a big circle for our planet Earth. Around and around and around. So there's so much water on Earth and there's a lot of land. So maybe I'll use green too. <gasps> yes, here's green right here. See green like trees or like a delicious avocado. <laughs> we'll put some green on here too. Oh, okay, there's Earth. And then I think I'm gonna paint some white stars too. Hey, did you know that there's over 100 billion stars in our galaxy? And that our galaxy is called the Milky Way. <laughs> we'll just do some stars like this all over. What do you think? I like it a lot. <laughs> wow, well, I'll let that dry for now. <laughs> I had so much fun playing and learning with you today. We got so inspired and we used our creativity and our imagination. <gasps> Remember when we learned about comets and how they're made of frozen space dust? I think that's so neat. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, I'll see you later. Bye. <gasps> Hi, it's me, Mika. And today we are at O2B Kids in Orlando, Florida. I'm so excited to be here because I love science and I get to do a science experiment right here. Will you do one with me? Awesome, let's see how we can get started. <gasps> Hi, I'm Mika. Hi Mika, I'm Trudy and welcome to ODBK's new learning playground. Hi Trudy, nice to meet you. Well, nice to meet you. So I heard that I could do a science experiment here and make elephant toothpaste. We love elephant toothpaste, and we've actually put together a scavenger hunt for you. What? That sounds so fun. Will you go on a scavenger hunt with me? <laughs> cool. So how do I start? You're all checked in and ready to go. Oh, okay. Let's go. <laughs> Check it out. We're at the science lab. For this science experiment, we need to find six items in our scavenger hunt. We need to find hydrogen peroxide, safety goggles, dish soap, food coloring, measuring cups, and yeast. <laughs> okay, can you help me look for these items? Great, let's go. Whoa. Mind gym. Whoa, this must be a room for your mind. <laughs> Wow, this is so cool. I recognize some numbers here. Will you count with me? <laughs> okay, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
Wow, that's so fun. Oh, okay, I don't see any items yet for our science experiment. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's kind of like a musical instrument. <laughs> see all these different colors? Oh, look, there's little items in here that you can find. Oh, looks like a balloon and a little fuzzy ball. Ooh, <laughs> this is fun. Cool. <gasps> Hydrogen peroxide. We found our first item for our science experiment. Hydrogen peroxide can help heal a cut, but you do not want to get this in your eyes. So we need to find safety goggles. Okay, good job. We have our first item. Check it out. A word find. So this big puzzle has a bunch of words in it, but they throw other letters in it to mix it all up. So it's kind of hard to see the words. See if you can find any words in here. You have to look really close. Oh, I found one. <laughs> look, P-E-A-R, pear. Ooh, that's a really yummy fruit. Any other words that can maybe give us a clue to the things that we're looking for? Oh, what about this word? Safety, safety, like safety goggles? Maybe there are safety goggles around here. Oh, look, there's some letters down here. <gasps> Do you know what letter this is? <laughs> it's the letter M for Mika. And it's one of my favorite colors. The color yellow. <laughs> <gasps> we did it! We found safety goggles. Safety goggles are really important when you do experiments because they protect your eyeballs. <laughs> All right, two items down, four to go. Safety goggles and hydrogen peroxide. All right, let's keep looking. <gasps> oh, whoa, it's like a grocery store or a market in here. <gasps> Look at all of this play food. Oh, cool. It looks like it's organized by color. I see green and orange and yellow. Ooh, what is in here? A cucumber slice. I love cucumbers. Oh, and a green apple. That's a nice healthy fruit. And one of my favorite vegetables, broccoli. <laughs> Ooh, and a tomato slice. These are all really healthy foods. Yeah, fruit and vegetables, they have nutrients and vitamins in there. So they're what I like to call an all the time food. They help you grow. Ooh, what's this? Some pizza. Mmm. <laughs> hey, let's see if we can find anything that we need for our science experiment. Whoa. This is like a little restaurant or a diner. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Put a little ketchup on here. Mmm, <laughs> pretty tasty. See if there's anything in here. <gasps> I found yeast. We need yeast in our science experiment. If you add warm water to yeast, it helps things rise. In fact, you need yeast to make bread. That's right. Hey, we are doing a great job on the scavenger hunt. Let's put this with our other things and then we can keep looking for more items for our experiment. <laughs> Good job. Let's keep looking. <sighs> okay, let's keep looking for more items for our science experiment. Whoa, there's a lot of fun things in here. Come over here. Oh, look at these big blocks. Huh, let's see. What can I make here? Okay. Hmm. Huh, feels pretty sturdy. It could be a new chair. <laughs> 
and put this on it, and this. Or it could be a throne. Queen Hamika. <laughs> oh, I still don't see anything for our science experiment. Hmm. Maybe there's something over here. Hey, a hula hoop. Check it out. Do you know what shape this is? <laughs> That's right, it's a circle. And it's the color green. Let's see if I can hula hoop. <laughs> Let me try again. Ready, set, hula hoop, hula hoop. Oh, that was a little better. Look, you can also put it on your arm like a giant bracelet and swing, 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 swing. But you know what? This is not something that we need for our science experiment. Fun though. Hmm. Oh, this is a really cool game. Look, you have a spinner and it tells you where to put your body on the dots. Left foot yellow, see? Left foot yellow. Hmm. Left foot yellow. Let's see if I can do one more turn on here. Whoop. This is left hand green. <laughs> Whoa, you have to try not to fall down. <sighs> I might fall down soon. <laughs> That's okay. All right. Hmm. Come over here. <gasps> Whoa, do you know what this is? It's a bottom of a slide. Should I go down the slide? Okay. Oh, wow, it looks like it's really high up. I wonder if there's anything at the top that we can use for our science experiment. I can't wait to make elephant toothpaste. <laughs> it says socks only. That means I need to take my shoes off. All right, let's, oh, they go in these cubbies over here. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go to the top and see if I can find something for our experiment. See you at the bottom. Oh, <laughs> hi. <gasps> I think I see something for our experiment. I'll see you soon. Woo! <laughs> Look what I found. Dish soap. We definitely need this for our experiment. Oh, I'm so excited. Thanks for your help. All right. I'm gonna grab my shoes and our other items for our experiment and we can keep looking. We have two more to find. Come on. Hello. <laughs> Let's keep looking. <gasps> cool clock. <laughs> Whoa, look over here. It says A-R-T, art. <laughs> This is an art space. <gasps> cool, look at this big piece of paper. Oh, I could color something on here. Ooh, look at all of these markers. I'm gonna choose purple because it's one of my favorite colors. <laughs> all right, let's see. What should I draw? Ooh, I know. See if you can guess. It's a science flask. You can use this in a science experiment, <laughs> but it kind of looks like something else. What do you think? Okay, I'll give you a hint. Do you know now? <laughs> it's two eyes and a nose. <laughs> what else does it need? Oh, right, a mouth. Give it a big mouth, a big smile. Hello. <laughs> oh, there's crayons too. Maybe I could put something else on here and choose a different color. Let's see. Um, oh, I found the food coloring. Look. <laughs> oh, a 
and it's my two favorite colors, purple and yellow. We're getting closer and closer to finding everything we need for our science experiment. One more item to find, come on. Whoa. <laughs> hey, look at this. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> cool bee. Wow, it looks like this bee's measuring something. <laughs> hey, Mr. Bee, I like your style, purple and yellow. Two of my favorite colors. <laughs> hey, it looks like we even have the same kind of shoes. <laughs> <gasps> measuring cups. That's the last thing we need for our science experiment. We found everything. Let's head into the science lab. Come on. Hey, Trudy. Hi, Mika. Welcome back. Thank you. I think that I found all of the items I need for the science experiment. Yay, may I see them? Oh, yeah. I have safety goggles, hydrogen peroxide, dish soap, food coloring, <laughs> yeast, and measuring cups. Congratulations, Mika, you are ready for the experiment. <gasps> wow, really? There you go. Oh, thank you so much. An official lab coat, awesome. Enjoy. Thank you. I'm so excited to do this experiment. Okay, everyone, safety first. <laughs> if you're doing this experiment at home, please make sure to do it with a grown-up. We are going to make elephant toothpaste. But remember, it's not really toothpaste, so please don't use it on your elephants. <laughs> the first step is we need to pour half a cup of hydrogen peroxide into this glass. Okay, then be nice and careful and pour it to the top. Okay. Step one, complete. Second, we need our dish soap. Okay. A squirt of dish soap in there. And you swirl it around, make sure it mixes a little bit together. Okay, that looks pretty good. And now, I'm going to add two of my favorite colors, purple and yellow. Okay. Get a little goop there. It looks black, but once it all mixes together, it's going to look purple. And yellow. And look, the yellow looks orange. But once it comes out of the cup, it's gonna look yellow. Okay. All right, next we are going to add our yeast to some warm water. And I already have some warm water right here. And you only need one teaspoon. So let me open this up and get one teaspoon of yeast. Okay. Ooh. There we go, one teaspoon. Add it to the water and stir it around. See, it's all mixing together. Okay. And then we're gonna add it to the glass and hopefully we will see our toothpaste in action. Going to the top. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> That's so cool. Whoa, did you see some of the colors? Wow, <laughs> it really looks like toothpaste. <laughs> oh, science is so much fun. Isn't that cool? Whoa, it's still going. Whoa. <laughs> there are the colors right there. Oh, that was so fun. Hey, thanks for helping me find all of those items for our science experiment. You were very helpful. <laughs> science is so fun. And we had a lot of fun today, right? We went on a scavenger hunt. We did a word puzzle. Oh, I went down a really cool green slide. And there was a pretend grocery store and art. We did a lot today, all for the love of science. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. If you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name.
Hey, will you spell my name with me? Cool. <gasps> Should we spell it on the planet? Science style. <laughs> Let's do it. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> Thanks for learning with me. See you soon. <laughs> It's me, Mika. Today I'm at Discovery Children's Museum in Las Vegas, Nevada. This place has so many fun things to learn about. I love learning about art and science by tinkering with things to see what'll happen. <laughs> That's called an experiment. Yeah, let's do cool experiments together. One, two, three, four. Are you ready to explore? Great, let's go. Whoa, water world. I bet there are some cool experiments here. <gasps> Let's move our bodies like water. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, look at this tall tower. I bet it does something really cool. <gasps> the ramps help move the water down to these two big circles. Check it out. One circle is yellow and the other is orange. Ooh, the yellow one is moving a lot faster than the orange one. And look, let's count the ramps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ramps. Oh, and look, some balls. Huh, I wonder what'll happen if we put the ball in here. Let's try it. Whoa! Check it out! The green ball is moving on the ramp! Let's see where it goes! Wow! It's a ball pit! There are so many colorful balls in here! Red, and yellow, and green too! <laughs> that was so amazing! Water can do so many things! Like make sounds. What is that sound? Let's go find out. <laughs> wow! Check out these musical chimes. Huh, I wonder how we can make it make music. Let's experiment and find out. <gasps> Do you hear that? <laughs> yeah! The water is hitting the ball in the chimes and making music. Clink, 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 clink. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> oh, and look at this one over here. Hmm, these chimes are a little different. I wonder what sounds they'll make. Oh, uh -huh. Whoa. oh it makes a sound when it's in the water, too. Sounds like a rushing river. <laughs> okay, let's flow over there. <laughs> Whoa, check out these wheels. Hmm, they have different shapes. I wonder what that means. <laughs> I got it, let's do a race. All right, back it up, back it up. Are you ready? On your mark, get set. And they're off. All right, they're going fast. Wow, the one with the cups is going much faster. <laughs> cool. Hey, I wonder what that is. Whoa, I wonder what these are for. Hmm. <gasps> Check it out. This one looks like slices of pizza. I'd like a slice. <gasps> <laughs> Let's see what happens when we do this. Oh, wow! It turns the water into different shapes and it comes out different ways. Let's try this one next. <laughs> Check it out! It's a fountain! <laughs> the harder I press, the higher it goes! Whoa! <laughs> nice! <laughs> oh, and look at these wheels! 
Hmm, I wonder what happens if we spin them. Wow, do you see those bubbles? Cool. Let's spin them together. Oh, it frick, it frick, it frick, it. DJ Mika coming to a pool near you. behind me? I wonder how it works. Hmm. Oh, look! It has blue straps that are attached with hooks. I think the blue straps are so you can lift the car up. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, look! Pick it up lever. <laughs> yeah! This must be a lever experiment. Ooh, let's go check it out. The bar balances the weight so that you can lift it with little effort. <laughs> Should we lift this car with the lever? <laughs> yeah, let's go. Oh, I wonder what'll happen when I pull this rope. Let's see. Whoa! <laughs> I lifted the car all by myself. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. We did it, we did it. We never ever quit it. We did it. <laughs> Wow, levers are pretty cool. Hey, check out those stairs. I wonder where they lead. Let's go find out. Oh. Oh, this is a music room. Did you know when you hear a sound, it moves through your ear canal and makes vibrations that tell your brain what you're hearing? <laughs> yeah, very cool. And look, this room has so many things we can make music with in different sounds. Let's give it a try. Oh, I wonder what would happen if we press this yellow button. <laughs> Let's find out. Whoa! Check it out! This has air! Let's put it over here. Look, it's a music note. The note <laughs> Let's try this green one. Oh, that's the note F. Okay, Blue, what do you have? <gasps> Archie! Okay, Purple. Do you know what this shape is? That's right, it's a triangle. Triangles have three sides. One, two, three. And they can make music too. Let's give it a shot. Whoa, 
<gasps> that sounds awesome! <laughs> Check it out! This is so colorful! Hmm. What happens if we hit this with this yellow stick? Let's see! Another note! Wow! Let's drag it across! <laughs> so cool! Whoa! Look! It's drums! Hmm. Let's count how many drums there are. One, two, three, four, five drums! Makes me wanna move my feet. Hey, I got it. Let's make a song. I'll give us a beat. Hey, I'm Mika, and I'm here to say I love exploring and tinkering away. Hey, give it a shot, try it out, see what it's about. <laughs> Drum roll, please, for the grand finale. Whoa! This place is so colorful. <laughs> I bet they have lots of things to tinker around with here. <laughs> What's this? Hmm, it kind of looks like a chalkboard. Let's confirm. <laughs> yep, a chalkboard. <laughs> Great job, scientist. <laughs> and look, it rotates. That means it spins. <gasps> Let's spin and draw. That was fun. Let's keep exploring. <laughs> wow. Let's draw on this. <laughs> Whoa. Look. <laughs> Do you know what color this is? <laughs> yeah, yellow. One of my favorite colors. Ooh, let's erase now. Mm -hmm. oh, erase. Now let's draw with this color. Do you know what it is? <laughs> yeah, blue. Hmm, let's see if you can guess what this is. Can you guess? Yeah, they're waves, just like down in Waterworld. <laughs> okay, what else did we draw? <gasps> hey, I know. Let's draw some shapes. <laughs> I like yellow. Do you know what this is? <laughs> yeah, a triangle, just like when we were playing the triangles. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> okay, how about this one? Yeah, it's an oval. <laughs> okay, one more. <laughs> Do you know what shape this is? <laughs> That's right, it's a shining star. <laughs> okay, let's erase and keep exploring. <laughs> Whoa, what's this? Oh, we can build something out of these pieces. <laughs> let's give it a try. Ooh, I wonder what's in here. <laughs> Whoa! This is really bendy. <laughs> Ooh, let's make another bridge. Two bridges. <laughs> Ooh, let's make a third bridge. Wow! Okay, those connect there. Hmm, I think I need a couple more pieces. This'll work. One more. <laughs> there we go. Whoa, look at all these bridges. <laughs> Let's go through it. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I've got it. Let's make a flower garden. <laughs> Ooh, this could be a rose. <gasps> and this can be a daisy. <laughs> Perfect little flower garden. <laughs> oh, 
Check out all this art. Whoa. <gasps> Look, a beach ball. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna throw it to you, friend. Ready, set. Oh, awesome catch. Okay, throw it back to me. Whoa, <laughs> good job. Check out these instruments. Let's play them. <laughs> oh, and look, a guitar. Pluck, pluck, pluck. Ding, 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 ding. <gasps> Do you see that dog? <laughs> yeah, it must be someone's pet. Oh, good girl. <laughs> well, that was fun. <laughs> Whoa! This place is amazing. We learned so much by doing experiments and trying things out for ourselves. We played with water. We lifted a whole car with a lever. And we tinkered around with some music and art. We did a lot. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. Okay, friends, see you later. Bye-bye. Woo! Beep, beep. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Dig It in Torrance, California. They have so many cool construction toys here, like excavators and conveyor belts. Oh, I'm going to pretend to be a construction worker. But first things first, safety first. I'll put on my hat and my safety vest. <laughs> Will you pretend to be a construction worker with me? Great, come on. <laughs> I'm at my first construction vehicle. Can you guess what it is? <laughs> I'll give you some hints. It has two arms and a bucket. <laughs> That's right, it's a front loader. Check it out. Okay, let's see how it works. Oh, start engine. Start. Wow. <laughs> let's honk the horn. Turn on my lights. And check out these pedals. Whoa! This is so cool. <laughs> okay, let's park. That was awesome. Ooh, and look at these big tires. Black and yellow. One of my favorite colors. Oh, let's see what this does. Spin, spin, spin. Whoa. So cool. We can roll it around. This is a big circle. Easier for rolling. <laughs> and these are called treads. They help the wheel get traction. <laughs> and check this out over here. Wow! It's like a construction site. <laughs> and there are three construction vehicles. Red, green, and blue. Oh, and it's a puzzle. The goal is to get each car to its site. This one is for the blue car. Okay, let's see if we can get it over. Hmm. Da, da, da. Hmm, best way to get there. Excuse me, Red. Da, da, da. Oh, I have to go up there. Excuse me, Red. You go down there. Da, da, da. <laughs> we made it. 
Okay, let's try for red. <laughs> da, da, da. Which way will we go? Huh, no, that's not the right way. <laughs> da, da, da. Oh, we made it. Okay, one more vehicle to go. Da, 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 da. Oh. Wow, we did it. We matched all the vehicles. That was so awesome. Oh, check it out. I see something cool over there. Let's go. Whoa, check out this building. It's pretty tall. Oh, and it has a lot of great shapes. Do you know what this shape is? That's right, a triangle. And this shape? Circle, great job. Put this triangle on top. Make sure everything's nice and tight. Hey, let's use this pipe wrench to make sure everything is tight. Nice and tight. <laughs> Great. I have another wrench in my jam pack. This one's called a crescent wrench because of the shape on top. <laughs> it kind of looks like a moon in the sky. <laughs> Okay, let's take our tools and see what needs fixing over here. Whoa, check out these big blue buildings behind me. <laughs> so tall. Hey, let's make an end together. Oh, and look, I have the perfect shape for that. Don't they look like rainbow arches? <laughs> yeah, okay. Awesome! Now I have a second rainbow arch. <laughs> wow! An M for Mika. <laughs> Job well done. Okay, our project is constructed and finished. On to the next one. We made it to the cement truck. Mix it up, mix, mix it up. Mix it up, mix, mix it up. Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> whoa. Oh, hey, this looks like a hamster wheel. That's a wheel that little hamsters and other animals use to run around and get their exercise in. But in construction, this wheel is used to mix cement. It turns it around and around and around, mixing it all together. Should we try it? Should we be cement that gets mixed and mixed and mixed together? <laughs> yeah, let's give it a try. <laughs> that made me a little dizzy. <laughs> Spin, 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 like a cement truck. Spin, 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 like a cement truck. <laughs> I saw a lot more cool things to do here while I was spinning. Come on, let's go learn more about construction vehicles. Beep, 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 burr. <gasps> We made it to our next construction vehicle. Can you guess what it is? I'll give you some clues. It has an arm and a boom and a bucket. That's right, it's an excavator. <laughs> Excavators are used to dig things up. Sometimes it's dirt, but this excavator digs up balls. Okay, we have to stay out of the construction zone, okay? <laughs> oh, here we go. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> awesome! Let's try it again.
We dug up a lot. Our job here is done. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> Look, it's a conveyor belt. A conveyor belt helps construction workers move things from one spot to another so that they don't have to carry them. <laughs> Great. Oh, and look, check it out. Look at all these bricks. <laughs> They're rectangular. See the shape? <laughs> and do you know this color? <laughs> yeah, brown. Oh, and there's another shape too. Can you see it? <laughs> right, circles. Let's count the circles. One, two, three. Great job. Mmm, <gasps> this kind of reminds me of chocolate. Let's pretend that these are chocolate pieces and we want to move them way up there. Come on, let's check it out. Okay, let's put them on the conveyor belt. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Great. Ready, little chocolates? <laughs> turn, turn, turn. Whoa! Wow! I have to keep turning, have to keep turning. <laughs> Whoa, let's get them all the way to the top. There they go! <laughs> yeah! Okay, now we're at the top. At the bottom, we put the chocolate bricks onto the conveyor belt and we turn the wheel, turn the wheel, turn the wheel until they went all the way to the top. And look, this is where they landed. <gasps> More bricks are coming. Check it out. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> okay, now I'm ready to go down the slide. I'll see you at the bottom. Woo! Woo! <laughs> yeah! That was so much fun. Whoa! What's this? Hmm, kind of looks like a bucket. Oh, check it out. When I pull this one down, that one goes higher. Oh, it's a pulley system. It helps get things from one place to another, just like a conveyor belt does. <laughs> Maybe I can send my friends some lunch at the top. <laughs> but since I don't have lunch, let's see what I have in my jam pack. Oh, look. A little construction vehicle. Let's put it in the bucket and send it up. <laughs> Ready? Here you go. <laughs> so cool. Let's put something in this bucket too. Let's see what I have in my jam pack. A tiger. Are you ready? <laughs> ready? In you go, have fun. Woo! <laughs> wow, now the tiger is going up high. And now it's coming down low. <laughs> now it's going up high. <laughs> and look, our construction vehicle is on the other side. <laughs> wow, being a construction worker is a lot of fun. Okay, let's drive away. <laughs> wow! A tractor race. Since I'm all done with my construction work, let's go on a tractor ride. Whoa, 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 in my big tractor. Go, 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 in my big tractor. Beep, beep, backing it up. Vroom! Whoa, that was so much fun. <laughs> Thank you so much for being a construction worker with me today. We rode a big front loader and we pretended to be cement, mixing around in a cement mixer. Then we used the little excavator to dig up a ball pit. 
<laughs> Whoa, we did a lot today. Now it's time to hang up my vest and roll on out of here. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. See you later. Hey everyone, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Sky Zone Trampoline Park in Anaheim, California. And I'm so excited because guess what's inside? Trampolines! Have you ever been on a trampoline before? They're so fun, you can jump and bounce really, really high. Have you ever wondered what makes something bounce? <laughs> Me too! Let's go inside and find out. Come on! Hello! Hi, how are you? I'm good, I'm Mika. I'm Quincy, it's nice to meet you, Mika. Hey Quincy, nice to meet you too. Ah, so, what can I do for you today, Mika? Well, I really want to play on some things that are bouncy, and I hear there are a lot of trampolines here. Oh, we have so many trampolines here today. Nice! But first, we have to pick from an assortment of wristbands. Whoa, look at all of these colors! I see orange, green, yellow, red, blue, and pink. Hmm, I think I'm gonna choose the yellow one. It's mm -hmm. one of my favorite colors. I got you right here, Mika. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> what else do I need? And next you get to pick between these two socks right here. Whoa, check out these socks. They have grips on the bottom. Why are there grips on these socks? There's grips on the socks just to prevent you from slipping on the bouncy trampolines. Oh, good idea. Oh, and there's also blue and black and pink socks. I think I'm gonna go with the orange. These are super cool. So I have my wristband and my socks, and I know that there are trampolines here, but is there anything else that you have that's really bouncy? It's funny that you ask. I got a whole picture of bouncy balls right here. Whoa! There's so many. This will be the perfect way to experiment with why and how things bounce. Thanks, yes, Quincy. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> it's so much fun to bounce. Whoa. <laughs> wow. Have you ever bounced on a trampoline before? It's so fun. And check this out. Do you push down on a trampoline like this? See how it goes down? But if you don't do anything, it goes back to being flat. That's called elasticity. <laughs> and that's what makes it so fun to bounce on a trampoline. <laughs> wow, let's check out all of these different kinds of balls and see how they bounce. All right, let's see, we have a squishy orange ball here. Whoa! And look at this one. It's orange too, but it's smaller. Kind of looks like a ball pit ball. Oh, it's nice and light. I wonder how this one bounces. Ooh, see ya! <laughs> Ooh, I love these. They're bouncy balls. <laughs> this is a nice green. Okay, ready? Oh, yeah, let me try again. <laughs> Here's another bouncy ball. Whoa! Nice job, bouncy ball! <laughs> Let's see what happens if we bounce the balls and I bounce at the same time! Woo! <laughs> hey! This woo, seems like a really fun space to play a game where you can bounce and throw these balls. Huh. If only I had some friends to play a game with. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey! Do you want to play a game with me? I would love to, Mika. Oh, awesome! But I got a friend with me as well. Oh, hey! This is Priscilla. Hi. Hi, Priscilla. I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. So, do you want to play a little catch on these trampolines I and with these bouncy balls? I would love to play some catch, Mika. Okay. Yeah, me too. Oh, let's do it. Everyone grab a ball. Get one over here. Oh, I know. What if we threw and caught the ball? so we can throw to each other and catch at the same time. 
I Makes like sense? It. I like that idea. I like okay, that. let's count to three. All right, ready? One, two, three. Whoa, we did it, nice. Did you do it again? Yes. All right, one, two, three. <laughs> awesome. One, two, three. Nice. Awesome. Ooh, I'm feeling nice and warm now. Me too. Whoa, what else can we play? We could play dodgeball. Ooh, dodgeball. How do you play dodgeball? Dodgeball is very simple. Hit or be hit. Oh, hit or be hit. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Don't be nervous. It's real simple. All you got to do is duck, dodge, and throw the ball. Oh, I got you. That okay, so we're going to try and throw the ball to hit the other people, but you don't want to get hit. You want to dodge and get out of the way, right? Exactly. Okay. <laughs> I'm feeling ready. Are you? I think so. I hope you're ready. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Me. Oh, of course, Mika. Thank you for having us. Yeah, this is so fun. So much fun. <laughs> Woo! See you later. So, we learned that things bounce because of elasticity. Woo! And it's really important to get our bodies warmed up and stretched really good so we can be stretchy and bendy like elastic so we don't get hurt. And I really want to try an obstacle course. So can you help me stretch and move my body so I can get warmed up and ready to go? Yes, of course. Let's okay. get ready for this obstacle course. <laughs> okay. Alrighty, so the first exercise we're gonna do, we're gonna put our arms like this. Okay. And you're gonna do a nice twist. Nice twist. All right, we're gonna switch arms again. Okay. Another big twist. Perfect. Okay, now we're gonna reach for the floor. Whoa. Whoa. And we're gonna hold it for three seconds. All right, one, one two. two. Three. Perfect. <laughs> Another big stretch. Whoa. Ready? One. One, two, two three. three. Perfect. Do you have Ooh. any other stretches that we could do? Hmm. Yeah. How about we grab our foot? You have to have really good balance and stretch your leg Ooh. that way. All right. <laughs> like <Ooh>. flamingos. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> All right. Try your other foot. All right. The other one. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> it's a little wobbly on this Whoa. one. Okay, perfect. Ooh, my legs feel nice and warm. Ready? My arms are stretched out. I think I'm ready for the obstacle course. All right, perfect. I hope you have fun. Thank you so much. All right. See you soon. See ya. Flippy B. 
Let's shake it all out and see what it's about. When we're dancing and singing so loud, get ready. Warm up now. Can you dance with me? One, two, three. Do the blip, baby. really low and I had fun bouncing too. <laughs> I hope you continue to learn with me. If you want to learn some more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> okay. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today, I'm at the Columbia Memorial Space Center in Downey, California. Can you guess what this is? It's a real capsule. Mm-hmm. And today, we're going to be astronauts and create a capsule of our own. Are you ready? OK. Blast off! I'm so excited to be in a shuttle today and be an astronaut. Do you know what an astronaut is? An astronaut is a person that goes up into outer space to study the moon and stars and planets too. I got it. Would you like to be an astronaut with me? <laughs> Great. All right, let me dial Mission Control. Mission Control, it's Commander Meeker here. Mm-hmm, my astronaut buddies and I are ready for takeoff. <gasps> oh, great. Counting down in three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> wow! <laughs> I can see so many stars and planets. I can see Mercury, and Venus, and Earth, and Mars, and Jupiter, Uranus, Saturn, and Neptune. <laughs> wow. <gasps> Did you know the sun is a star? <laughs> I know, so cool. OK, let's go power and explore. Click, click. <laughs> wow, check it out. It's a real spacesuit, just like astronauts wear when they go on moonwalks in space. <laughs> it's white with red accents. Oh, and the material is really, really tough to protect astronauts when they're in space. And look at this helmet. This is so astronauts can breathe oxygen out in space. I want to get inside. Come on. Hi, I'm an astronaut. <laughs> wow. Oh, an asteroid. <laughs> I can see so many stars and planets up here. Whoa, check it out. I have a flight suit 
on my own. <laughs> I'm astronaut Mika, and I'm ready to explore space. Are you ready? <gasps> vroom, 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 zoom, 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 let's go. <gasps> this is a robotics lab. This is where scientists called engineers code a rover. A rover is a big truck that moves along a planet's surface and takes pictures of rocks and dirt. And the cool thing is it's controlled by a scientist on Earth. That way, they can learn about what a planet is like. Come on, let's go code a rover. Coding the rover means I'm planning out how it'll move on the planet. <laughs> okay. I'm setting up this rover to take lots of pictures of Mars and pick up a rock. Okay, now that it's set, let's place it on the table. <gasps> Whoa, this rover reminds me of an excavator. It picks up rocks instead of dirt though. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, let's hope the rover picks up this rock. Here we go. Not quite. Let's try again. Here we go. Ready? <laughs> Yay! We did it! We taught the rover how to pick up a rock. Now, scientists can use these rocks to discover different things about the planet, like how big it is, how old it is, and what can survive there. <laughs> cool! Let's go! This is where we can build our own capsule, just like Apollo 11. Let's get our supplies. First, we'll need two pieces of black yarn. One, two. Next, we need a cardboard capsule. Then we need a sheet of tissue paper. Oh, there are lots of different colors in here, but I'm gonna pick yellow, just like my headband. A capsule is a piece of the rocket that the astronauts use to come back to Earth in. We're punching some holes in there. Awesome! Two holes punched in our capsule. Now we'll punch some holes in our tissue paper. One hole. And two. Awesome! Next, we'll take our black yarn and we'll loop it through the holes. Oh, I bet my best friend Blippi and I would have a great time in one of these. <laughs> I love traveling through space with my best friend. Okay. <laughs> okay, one last step. Take our silver handle and put tape it on top. Now I need two pieces of tape. One. Awesome. Two. Now we have our capsule and we're ready to launch. Ready? One, two, three. All right, Mission Control, we did it. We went all the way into outer space and now we're safe back on planet Earth. We were really busy exploring space and when it was time to come back to Earth, we landed safely in our parachutes. I just wanna thank all the scientists for their hard work and I especially want to thank my best friend Blippi for always believing in me and my mission. <laughs> Now let's go see what other things we can make fly through the air. Come on! Check it out! An airplane building station. That's 
That's right. Airplanes fly through the air, too. Okay, I'll start with a sheet of paper, and then I'll fold it in half. Paper airplanes help us understand how real airplanes fly through the sky. Oh, look, I just made a triangle. See? <laughs> Triangles have three sides. All right, fold it one more time. And another time on this side. And look, we have an airplane. Woo! Whoa! Let's go! Oh, we made it to the launching pad. The shape of the wings is what makes it possible for an airplane to fly. When the wings are flat and then curved at the end, air pressure can sit on top of the plane, which makes it possible to fly through the air. <gasps> okay, let's make sure our launching pad is lined up just right. There we go. So we'll put the plane here and we'll push this green button in three, two, one. Wow! Look at that airplane go! <laughs> Check it out! I'm in a science lab. Astronauts are scientists too. That's because they do experiments when they're exploring on the moon. An experiment is when you try something new to see what will happen. Sometimes you need a parent or an adult to help you. I've got it. Let's do an experiment and learn together. Will you help me with my ooey gooey experiment? <laughs> Great. Let's start off with a quarter cup of water. Splash. And then we'll add a quarter cup of sticky ooey gooey glue. <laughs> now we'll have to take our popsicle stick and stir, stir, stir. Stir, 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 stir it up. Stir up that glue. Stir, 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 stir it up. I love to experiment with you. <laughs> okay, we gotta get our glue and water all mixed in. Wow, this is so cool. Okay, we're ready to add our glitter. And guess what? It's my favorite color, purple. Wow, so pretty. Looks very stellar. <laughs> okay, we have our purple glitter, and now we're gonna add a quarter cup of starch. And that'll make it extra, extra sticky. Wow, do you see it? It's forming in one big lump. Wow. Okay, I think it's almost ready. <gasps> I think we're ready to touch it. Ooh, <laughs> it's so sticky and ooey gooey. <laughs> I've got it. I'll name my slime hmm, Lunar Slime. <laughs> Thank you so much for exploring space with me today. We wore a spacesuit, we coated a rover, and we created our own capsule and watched it float back down to Earth. That was cool. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> all right. See you later. Bye-bye. Hey, everyone. It's me, Mika. And today, I'm at Sky Zone Trampoline Park in Anaheim, California. <laughs> Ooh, look at these blocks. They're so fun and light. They're made out of foam. And look, this one is orange. And oh, there's a blue one there, too. And it says, whoa. Welcome! <laughs> That's so nice! I'm really excited because there are trampolines here and foam pits that you can jump into. And I really want to learn how to do a flip. 
I wonder if there's someone here who can teach me how to do that. Let's go find out. Nika. Hi, I'm Priscilla. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Welcome to Sky Zone. Ooh, thank you. I'm so excited to be here. <laughs> awesome. Okay, first we do need to pick out some wristbands Ooh, in order to go inside the park. I love wristbands. Hmm. So which color would you like? Oh, let's see. There's orange, green, <gasps> yellow. Yellow is one of my favorite colors. I Mine want this one. too. All right, here, let's go. Thank you, so official. <laughs> and now we have to pick out some socks. Okay, why do we need to put on special socks? The special socks have grip on them so that when you're on the trampoline, you don't slip. Oh, that's so smart. Hmm, let's see, we have some orange socks and ooh, some blue and black and pink socks. Hmm, I think I'm gonna go with the orange. I love this color, and my best friend Blippi really loves orange. I'm gonna wear these. All right, perfect. <laughs> Thank so you. What brings you in today? Oh, I really want to learn how to do a flip on the trampoline. All right, perfect. We have Quincy in the park who can teach you how to do a flip. Wow. Okay, let's go find Quincy. Thank you. Of course. <laughs> Trampolines! And this huge foam pit behind me. Wow, I've never seen so many trampolines before. Will you count them with me? Awesome, let's go. Okay, ready? One! <laughs> Two! Three! Four! Five! Wow, five trampolines! Huh, I wonder where Quincy is. That's who's supposed to teach me how to do a flip. Oh, I'm so excited. Where is he though? I wonder if he's in the foam pit. Should I jump in and see? <laughs> Let's do it. Woo, wow! <laughs> Quincy! Quincy? Hmm. Quincy! I don't think anyone's in here, except me. <laughs> Whoa, it says foam zone. That's where we are, in this big foam zone. Check out these blocks. Look, you see a square? When there's six squares together, that makes a cube. And these are made out of foam, so it's soft and squishy, so it feels really fun and nice to jump into a foam pit. And you don't get hurt. <laughs> Look, there's orange, blue, and black. <laughs> this is so fun. I can't wait till I learn how to do a flip. I wonder where Quincy is. <gasps> Maybe he's over there. Come on, let's go look. Whoa, this is cool. But I still don't see Quincy anywhere. Huh. Whoa. I know what this is. It's orange, it's round, and oh, it bounces. This is a basketball. But why would a basketball be at a trampoline park? Hey. There's a basketball hoop <laughs> and another trampoline. I bet jumping on a trampoline and throwing a basketball into the hoop is a lot easier than if you're just on a regular ground. Oh, I'm gonna try it. Okay, let's see. On three. One, two, three. Ah, didn't get it in. Oh, here's another one. It's yellow. Maybe I'll try and throw it. Words. One, two, three. Whoa. Oh, whoopsie. <laughs> oh, there's another one. Hmm. Maybe if I do three big bounces to the hoop, that will go in. Ready? One, two, three. Ah, there's one more ball. Okay, how should I do this one? 
Hmm. Maybe I'll do one giant bounce and a turn for finesse. <laughs> Ready? One. Oh, I still didn't get it in. <laughs> That's okay. I'm gonna keep looking for Quincy. I can't wait to learn how to do a flip. <sighs> Quincy! No, Quincy. <laughs> Let's go over to the other side. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> do you know what this is? This is a balance beam. It's called that because it's a beam and you have to have really good balance to stand on it. Whew, you don't wanna wobble and go side to side. Did you know that there are a lot of animals who have really good balance? And mostly because of their tails. <laughs> Squirrels have really good balance because of their swooshy tails and cats, meow, meow. <laughs> and kangaroos. Yeah, kangaroos have long tails that help them balance and they're really good jumpers. <laughs> Will you jump with me? <laughs> hey, let's jump over there. Woo! <laughs> Whoa, more trampolines. Look how many are in here. Whoa! Wow! That has to be Quincy! He's so good at jumping! Whoa! Whoa! Wow! Are you Hello? Quincy? I am Quincy. Hi, I'm Mika! It's nice to meet you, Mika. How nice you doing? You too. I'm having so much fun here. Oh, I'm so glad to hear that, Mika. So I heard that you are really good at flipping. You might have heard right. Oh, well, I want to learn how to flip too. Can you help me? I can take good care of you. Awesome. What do we need to do first? All right, first and foremost, we have to warm up. Oh, right. It's important to warm up our body so we don't get hurt. Exactly, Mika. Okay, so what do we need to do? So first things first, you know, we're just going to touch the ground. Oh, okay. We're just touch, touch the, the ground. ground. Oh. You know, then we're going to lean to the left. And then we're going to lean it to the right. Okay. Ah. And you know, once your legs feel all good, you get some jumping jacks in. Woo! You know, you know, have some fun with it. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Wow, it's kind of like making a snow angel in the air. Exactly. Whoa! <laughs> wow! Okay, I'm feeling pretty good. I'm getting warmer and looser. Are <laughs> right, you feeling warm and loose? I think so. All right, let's see if you can do a jump twist then. Jump to us. Okay, ready? Ooh, like okay. that? Just like that. Wow. <sighs> I got what else one can we do? Well, you ever done a somersault? Yeah, have you ever done a somersault before? Okay, let's do it together. All right, you know how to do a somersault, Mika? Yeah. So what are the first steps, just first as a steps, reminder? Visualize your platform. Ooh, okay. Visualize. Then you're gonna put your hands out. Okay. Oh. And fall. Okay, so hands out, and what do I do with my head? You're gonna tuck your head in like a bowling ball. Oh, tuck your head in like a bowling ball. You're gonna tuck and roll. And then become the ball. Become the ball. <laughs> Here I go. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that, Mika. That was so fun. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Okay, ready? All right. Visualize. Visualize. Head tucked. Head tucked. And become the ball. Become the ball. Whoa, that was really fun. It was really fun. Now I got a question for you. Yeah. Think you can do it in the air? Oh, I've never tried before. You want me to show you? Yes, please. All right. Well, first, you're gonna get a whole lot of air. Whoa. A whole lot of air. And then, next you're gonna do, you tuck your chin again. So once you get all that air, you're gonna tuck your chin. And remember, only try and do a flip if you're with a grown up. Please? just did a front flip in the air. That was amazing. <laughs> ah, thank you. How do you jump that high? Uh, <sighs> basketball helps. Whoa. Whoa. Sometimes, you just gotta have fun with it in the air. 
I'm gonna be a leg. Wow! You're so good Meditate at jumping! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Wow! That was so fun! But Quincy, I don't know if I'm ready to do a flip in the air like you just did. Well, you gotta keep practicing, Mika, and then you'll get it. I got it. So, I have to remember to jump really high, stay in one spot, tuck my head, and go forward like a ball. Exactly, it's just like a somersault, but you're taking away the ground. Got it, thank you so much. Of course, Mika. I'm gonna take all of these things and I'm gonna practice and then one day I'll get to do a front flip just like you, Quincy. I hope so, Mika. <laughs> thank you so much. Of course, I'm gonna go bounce now. All right, me too, see you later. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> wow, that was so much fun playing and bouncing at Sky Zone Trampoline <laughs> I really wanted to learn how to do a flip today, and Quincy was an amazing teacher. He knows a lot about flipping and bouncing on trampolines. Oh, and it was so fun jumping into the foam pit. The foam pit was nice and soft and squishy and oh, made out of blocks like this. Wait a second. Do you know what this says? It says... Mika, <laughs> that's me, that's my name. Well, I had so much fun playing and learning with you today. If you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Awesome, M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. We'll see you next time, bye. It's Farmer Mika in the Dell, Farmer Mika in the Dell. Hi ho the Dario, it's Mika in the Dell. <laughs> Hi friends, it's me Mika. Nice to meet ya. And today I'm at the Children's Museum at La Habra. Museums are a great place for minds growing and flowing. <laughs> and we have a busy day on the farm. Oh, I hope we get to meet some chickens. Or maybe a cow? Moo! <laughs> Would you like to explore with me? Oh, great! One, two, three, four! Are you ready to explore? <laughs> yeah! Let's get moving! Here we go! Let's hop in! Oh, first things first! Safety first! All buckled up, friend? Oh, great. Ready for the farm? <laughs> yeah! Here we go! <gasps> Look! We made it to the farm! <laughs> Yay! Let's take a closer look. Hey! This is a vegetable garden. Yeah, that's where lots of yummy vegetables grow. Vegetables are really good for your body. They help you stay healthy and strong. <gasps> Ooh, and there are so many different types of vegetables. But these vegetables are growing underground. <gasps> yeah, they're root vegetables. Root vegetables are carrots and potatoes. And hmm, what's this one? A beet! <laughs> I like beets. They taste really rich and delicious. <gasps> and look! Do you know what this is? <laughs> it's a turnip. <gasps> yeah, you never know where they might turn up. <laughs> I know. Let's collect some vegetables for our lunch. We'll start with carrots. Hmm, will you count the carrots with me? Oh, great. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six carrots. Six orange carrots. But did you know carrots come in lots of different colors? <laughs> yeah, there are red carrots and white carrots and yellow carrots and purple carrots. That's right, carrots come in my two favorite colors. Let's grab some potatoes next. Let's dig them out. Dig, 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 dig. Oh, whoa, 
One potato. Two potato. Let's grab one more potato. <laughs> Three potatoes. Hmm, I'd like one beet, please. Dig, dig, dig. One beet. And let's get one turnip, too. <laughs> Yay! Oh, this is gonna make a delicious stew. Whoa! Check it out! It looks like an orchard! <gasps> Whoa! An orchard is where fruit and nut trees grow. This is an orange tree. <gasps> Let's collect some oranges. Maybe we can put them on a salad. <gasps> One. Two, three, nice and right. Oh, there's so many things you can do with an orange. You can squeeze, squeeze, squeeze them and make some orange juice for breakfast. And you can use the peels for compost. Oranges are really, really nutritious. They have lots of vitamin C. <laughs> Wait, I see some more trees over there. Let's go check it out. I know. Let's be a buzz and buzz over to that orchard. Buzz. Whoa, check out this orchard. There are so many different trees here. Let's count the trees. One, <laughs> two, and three. Three trees. This one has lemon on it, and this one has avocado, and this one over here has oranges. Do you know what they all have in common? <laughs> yeah, they're fruit trees. And do you know what makes a fruit a fruit? Fruits all have seeds. Look, see, an avocado has one big brown seed inside. <gasps> I know. Let's make some guacamole. Let's grab four avocados. One, two, <laughs> three, four. Actually, four and a half. Now we need some lemons. Okay, let's get two lemons. One, <laughs> Two, two lemons. Hey, maybe we can make some lemonade. That sounds refreshing. <laughs> Look, I'm riding on a tractor. Oh, and check it out. There's another vegetable garden with root vegetables. Oh, we haven't added cauliflower yet. Let's get one. One cauliflower. Add it to our bag and let's keep rolling along. Oh, I'm farming, oh, I'm farming, oh, I'm farming vegetables in my garden. Yeah, I'm farming for some dinner with my friends. Oh, look, it's a tractor parking lot. Let's park. <laughs> <laughs> Let's count how many tractors there are. One, two, two green tractors. I'll leave my vegetables right here so I can explore. <gasps> Look, there are some animals. Hello, sheep. I'm Mika, nice to meet ya. Would you like some pets? <laughs> okay, wow, you're so soft. Do you know what sound a sheep makes? That's right. Bah, bah. <laughs> How about this animal? The kitty cat. Hello, kitty. <laughs> Do you know what sound this kitty cat makes? Meow, meow, meow. Oh, you're so sweet. Hey, I see a barn over there. Let's go see what's inside. Woo! Whoa, check it out. A big red barn. What's that? <laughs> There's a cow inside. Let's say hello. Hello, cow. I'm Mika. 
nice to meet you. <gasps> this cow is black and white. Do you know what sound it makes? <laughs> That's right, moo, moo. <laughs> hey, I peeped some chicken over there. Let's go say hi. <laughs> hey chickens, I'm Mika, nice to meet you. Let's count how many chickens there are. One, two, three. Three little chickens. Oh, in three different colors. Gray, brown, and beige. <laughs> Did you know chickens are the closest living relative to dinosaurs? Rawr! <laughs> so cool. Oh, let's see what's in here. Oh, there's some eggs. Excuse me, chickens. May I have some eggs? <laughs> Thank you so much. Let's grab my bag and get some eggs. Oh, hey, look. The eggs are in two different colors. White and brown. Let's count all of the eggs. And we have to be very, very gentle because eggs are delicate, which means they're easy to break. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> six eggs. Oh, thank you so much for being so generous, chickens. Oh, we have so many healthy fruits and vegetables and eggs with us. Let's go see what we should make for lunch. I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa, check out this farmhouse. Oh, let's wash our hands before we have some lunch. All right, ready to go. A stove. Let's scramble some eggs. Crack. <laughs> Crack. Mmm, <laughs> yum. An ice box. Hmm, let's put our cauliflower inside for later. How about some carrots, too? That way they stay nice and cold. That was a long day at the farm. I'm really hungry. Oh, hello, kitty cat. Thanks for joining me. Oh, you're hungry too? All right, let's see what we have. One potato for you, and one potato for me. One avocado for you, kitty cat, and one avocado for me. Oh, a carrot for you, pal, and a carrot for me. <laughs> oh, some more eggs, yes. One egg for you and one egg for me. Oh, don't forget some lemon. There you go, a whole lemon for you and hmm, an orange for me. <laughs> Is that all? Oh, don't forget our turnip. Mm-hmm, a turnip for you and a beet for me. Let's count how many items the kitty cat has. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> Hope you're really hungry. Okay, bon appetit. Let's eat. <laughs> Such a great day on the farm with you. What did we learn today? One, two, three, can you tell me? <laughs> I learned that fruits have seeds. And I also learned that root vegetables grow in the ground. Oh, that was so much fun. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? Oh, great. M-E-E-K-A. 
K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> okay, friends, see you later. Bye-bye. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at Play Lab in Eagle Rock, California. There's so many different kinds of toys to play with inside. There's even dinosaur toys. <laughs> and my friend Naish is stopping by to teach us colors in American Sign Language. Let's go. Cool, a train table. Have you ever played with toy trains before? They're so fun. <gasps> Look at this one. There's one, two, three, four cars. And they're sticking together. Check it out. They're magnetic, meaning they attract to each other. See, they stick together. Whoa, look at the wheels. Let's see the colors on top of here. We have orange, black, red, and red. All right, Conductor Mika is ready to take this train on a trip. All aboard! All right, guess it's time for me to keep playing. See you later, train. <laughs> Let's go over here. This is a cool room to play in. Hey. Hello? <gasps> Hi, Grandma. Uh-huh. Oh, I'm just playing with my friends. Yeah, yeah. Can I call you back? Okay, bye, Grandma. <laughs> oh, and look, there's little babies in here. Oh, it's so cute. Hi, baby. Oh, what? Oh, it's nap time. Shh, sorry. Hey, I wonder if I could climb up here. It's kind of small. Do you think I'll fit? All right, I'll try it. Hello, up here. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Oh, it looks like I'm on a bridge. Oh, and there's a little slide. Three, two, one. Whoa. <laughs> what? Using dinosaurs? Oh, I love dinosaurs. Whoa, these are really cool. Look at this one. See the plates on the back? Oh, that means, hello. <laughs> Whoa, and this one has a crest. You know a lot of dinosaurs that have a crest like this? Instead of roaring, they would kind of sound like honk, honk, <laughs> honk, honk. Whoa, this one has some sharp teeth in there. Ooh. Very cool. And this one has wings so we can fly. Whoa. These dinosaur toys are so cool. My favorite dinosaur is the T-Rex. I wonder if they have a T-Rex here. It's not that one. Not this one with the long neck. T-Rexes don't have long necks. Oh, here it is. Hi, Mika. Hey, T-Rex, how are you? I'm fine. I want to go down the slide. Oh, you have to ask nicely. Can I go down the slide, please? Oh, sure. Here we go. All right. Are you ready? Three, two, one. What's wrong? Oh, he's a little bit nervous. Let's just say... You can do it! You got this! Okay. You can do this! You got this! Come on, T-Rex! Yeah! You did it! Oh, I'm so proud of you! Thank you. <laughs> Aw, that was fun. Whoa, look at these blocks. They're soft and squishy. Hmm, maybe we could build a tower. See if I could build a tower? It's tall. 
as me. Whoa. Okay. I have to get even taller than that. Oh. I have to have really good balance blocks. Oh no. Come on. Taller. Taller. It has to be taller. We gotta make the blocks even taller and taller. Come on, blocks. Taller and no. <laughs> That's okay. I'm gonna clean up real fast. <laughs> Hi, Naisha. Oh, who's your friend? This is my friend who's an interpreter. Her name is Rory. Oh, hi, Rory. I'm Mika. Hi, Mika. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. So Rory's an interpreter, so she's going to help us communicate, which is good because I only know a little bit of sign language. And I'm so excited that you are both here so that we can learn some colors in American Sign Language. All right. Yes, we can. So let's start with, ooh, what about this balloon? Do you know what color this is? It's orange. So how do we say orange in American Sign Language? Like this? Okay, are you doing it? Orange. Good job. Cool, all right, that orange. <laughs> Ooh, what about this one? It's one of my favorite colors. Do you know what it is? Purple, that's right. So how would we say purple? Oh, the letter P, right? Purple. Yeah, because P is the first letter in the word purple. I got it, cool. Bye, purple. Oh, do you know what color this balloon is? It's pink, good job. Okay, so how would we say pink? So the letter P again. And then you hit your chin like this. Pink. Good job. All right, bye pink. <laughs> Ooh, what about this little balloon? Do you know what color this is? It's blue. Ooh, like my fingernails. <laughs> How do we say blue in American Sign Language? Okay, so the letter B and then kind of wave it like that. Cool, are you trying it? Good job, blue. Bye, blue. And this balloon is what color? Red, nice. So how would we say red? Okay, so you take one finger and you rub your chin like this, red. <laughs> nice, bye red. Oh yes, another one of my favorite colors. Do you know what it is? Yellow! Okay, how do we say yellow in American Sign Language? Okay, so like the letter Y, and then wave it. Can you do that? Yellow! Good job! Bye, yellow! Wow, thank you so much for teaching us how to say those colors in American Sign Language. It's great to see you and to be able to teach you. Oh, it's good to see you too, and really nice meeting you, Rory. All right, I'm gonna keep playing inside, but I hope to see you two later. <laughs> Bye. Oh, cool. There are more toys in here. A helicopter. <laughs> oh, look, a little car. Uh-oh, it needs a driver. Oh, I can drive. Oh. You can, can I see your driver's license? Whoop, looks like you, yep. Okay, get on in. All right, enjoy the ride. Vroom. Whoa, whoa, hey, slow down. My bad, it's okay. Nice part job. <laughs> oh, look at these circles. See a red circle. <gasps> Oh, hi! <laughs> nice smile. <laughs> and let's see what's under the orange one. Oh, another friend! Hello! And another orange. <gasps> hi! Oh, cool blue glasses. And let's look under this yellow one. Oh, hi! 
And look, look under this other yellow one. Oh, hello! <laughs> I didn't know there were gonna be friends in there. Oh, cool! Check out these shapes! It looks like this one's missing, but we could start with this circle. All right, let's go right there. And, oh, a triangle. All right, see you later, triangle. Do you know what this is? It has one, two, three, four, five sides. That's a pentagon. All right, later, pentagon. And this is a trapezoid. Yeah, very cool shape. Go in there. Yeah, they all fit. Nice. Whoa, look at these colorful blocks. Let's check them out together. Hmm, let's see. I like this blue one and purple. Hmm, yellow or is this orange? This one's more like yellow, right? Yeah, orange, yellow, pink, and red. Wait a second, these are the colors that we learned with Naisha, remember? American Sign Language? Let's see if we can remember, okay? Do you remember how to say red? Red. Yeah, good job. What about pink? Do you remember how to sign pink? Pink, pink. Good job. Ooh, what about yellow? I really like this one. Yellow, remember? <laughs> and orange, orange is, yeah, orange. And purple, one of my favorites. Remember, purple, good job. And what about blue? Yeah, make the letter B, blue. Good job, that was so fun learning that today. <laughs> I had so much fun playing with you today at Play Lab. There's so many different toys inside. We got to play with trains and dinosaurs, <laughs> and blocks, and my friend Naisha taught us some colors and American Sign Language. Wasn't that so cool? Thanks for learning with me. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Great, <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Okay, friends, bye. <laughs> hey, it's me, Mika, and today I'm at the Children's Creativity Museum in San Francisco, California. Oh, guess who snuck into my jam pack today? It's my dino pal, Dolores. Say hi, Dolores. Hello. <laughs> oh, that's right. Dolores has dreams of becoming an amazing rock star. Yeah. Well, guess what? This is the perfect place because here at the museum, we can write our very own original rock song. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, let's do it. It was such a good song. I just, whoa! <gasps> Did you hear that? Whoa! <laughs> Everywhere I step, a note's being played. Wait, when I stand on the gray, I don't hear anything. It's the circles. Do you see all of these circles? <laughs> I've never played on anything like this before. Wow. What if I only jumped on the yellow circles? All right, ready? <laughs> what if I only jumped on the green? <laughs> Dolores, do you wanna try? Okay, um, which color? Oh, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, orange. Ooh, that's a really high note. It's a little lower. Uh-oh, it's getting really soft. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> this is really fun. You can play an instrument with your feet. Wait, I have an ID. 
Yeah, I can use my feet to play this instrument. And I can use my hands. You're all zipped in, Dolores, nice and safe. Here we go! Whoa! I use my feet and I use my hands. I wonder what else we can use to make music. Come on, Dolores, let's go! <laughs> Whoa! Wow, this museum is really cool. And there's so many different ways that you can make music. There's different sounds and different instruments, like oh, this one over here. Have you ever seen this before? This is a microphone. Yeah, maybe you see a lot of singers holding a microphone and singing, yeah. That way everyone can hear them. Try it out, Dolores. Oh, Mika, I'm ready for my song. Dolores, you are ready. You go, girl. <laughs> oh, there's another instrument over here. <gasps> this is a synthesizer. Look at all these different buttons. And each one creates a different sound, a different instrument. There's beats. Wow, there's a lot you can do on a synthesizer. And check it out over here. It's a drum, one of my favorite instruments. Wow, what do you think, Dolores? Mm-hmm, you like it? Do you know how we can hear music? Sound waves enter our ear canal and then the sound vibrates our eardrum. Isn't that cool? <laughs> oh, let's see what this says. Start a new song by picking a backing track. Whoa, let's see, there's a triangle, a shakers, a drum kit, disco. Ooh, a bass line? What's the bass line? Let's listen. Ooh, I feel that groove. Okay, let's do the bass line, Dolores. So that will be our back track, and then we can record the drums on top of it. this really cool badge that will save all of our sounds for our song. Come on, Dolores, let's go to the next instrument. Acoustic guitar, okay. Hmm, okay, maybe, maybe. Electric guitar, that's gonna sound a little more rock and roll. Okay, let's see. I think that's the one. Okay, so we're gonna choose electric guitar. Gonna press record. We're gonna add electric guitar to our song. Three, two, one. Hear what we did before? Yeah, where's the drum? My favorites, the microphone. It's time to sing. Okay, Dolores, you can be here. Sing out. <laughs> this is a robot voice. Hello, this is Mika. Beep bop boop. <laughs> Intercom. <gasps> Ooh. What about monster? <gasps> <laughs> or this is the chipmunk voice. <laughs> What do you think, Dolores? You want to try it? Sure, I'll try it. <laughs> what if we record a song in a chipmunk voice? <laughs> Let's go. Dino stumps. This is Dolores, she's a dino. She's about to sing, and it's not about rhinos. Go, girl, sing it out. 
Mixer, this is awesome because you can see all the different things that we recorded and here at the mixer, we can adjust the sound levels, make sure it sounds really good to complete our song. Okay, can you hear Dolores, right? Let's hear the song. Okay, what if I mute the voice, the synthesizer, track and then we can only hear the drum. Hear it? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. When you count the beats like that and you put them together into a pattern, that makes a rhythm. Isn't that cool? <laughs> All right, how's that sound? Oh, dance with me, Dolores. Okay, so we're gonna save it. I can't believe that we made our very own song together. <laughs> Let's see what else we could do. Ready? Yeah! Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom, boom. Ding, 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 That's a leg guitar. Oh, Dolores, look at this table. Looks like a craft table. There's a lot of craft supplies and recycled items. <gasps> This gives me a great idea to make a musical instrument. Yeah, you can make your very own instrument at home if you have craft supplies or recycled items like this. Hmm, let's see, there's some string, some wooden sticks, fabric. Ooh, a feather. <laughs> oh, I have a good idea. I wonder if you can guess what I'm going to make. Hello. Hello, testing, testing. <clears throat> I'm gonna put this on this end of the box here. You know what I'm making yet? You know what it is? It's a guitar! <laughs> Out of a tissue box and a paper tube and rubber bands. Yeah, dinosaur. Yeah, 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 they go raw. <laughs> what do you think? It was a really big guitar for you, Dolores. But it's kind of like a ukulele size for me. <laughs> Come on, let's see what else we can do here. This museum is so cool. Bing, 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 bing. That's a great sounding guitar. <laughs> Whoa, this is a great setup for a music video. Dolores, look at this. Check out the backdrop. It's a beautiful blue. <gasps> hey, that's one of my best friend Blippi's favorite colors. <laughs> I bet you knew that. And ooh, look at this little setup. There's a keyboard and some drums and a really cool dance floor. This is a good spot for you to stand and sing and rock out, Dolores. Oh, and there's some more decorations over here. Looks like a guitar and the letter M. That's the first letter in my name, Mika. Put that there and whoop. And then there's a blue star because you're a star, Dolores. You're a star. <laughs> That's there. And oh my goodness, there's a guitar that's just your size, Dolores. Oh, this is gonna be so fun. I just need a camera. Here we go. Here's a camera. This way we can make a stop motion video. Do you know what stop motion is? 
It's when you take something, put it in a position, and you take its picture, and then you put it in another position, take a picture, and then put it in another position, take a picture, and you put it all together to make a moving picture. Here, for example, I'm about to run. Take my picture. Take another picture. And then take another picture, and when you put it together, it would look like this. Isn't that cool? Okay, Dolores, are you ready to be a star in your music video? Oh, don't be nervous, you're gonna be great. You got this. Okay, start with you walking onto the stage with your guitar. Looking good. Okay, let me see in the camera. Okay, a little more energy. Oh yeah, that's the one. <laughs> okay, and then the next one can be a little bit more facing the audience. Okay, big smile, rock star. Oh yeah, this is gonna be such a good music video. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I had so much fun making music with you today and coming up with our very own original song. And don't you think it's so cool how we can hear music and sounds and that sound waves come into our ears and vibrate our eardrums like this? Ooh. <laughs> it's really, really neat. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika, <laughs> good job. Hey, do you want to be in a band with us? They said yes. We better get to band practice. See you soon. <laughs> hey, it's me, Mika, and look where I'm at. I'm at Spokane Gymnastics in Spokane Valley, Washington. And this is an amazing place where I can jump and play and move my body and probably do even more cartwheels. Let's learn how to do some gymnastics. Come on. Wow, check it out. We are in a gymnastics gym. This is a place where you can practice your gymnastics moves and climb and stretch and jump. Whoa, look at this. It looks like a giant crayon. Do you know what color this is? The color green. <laughs> Let's see. Woo, these look like some fun shapes. This is a triangle. Ooh, and this is also green. And look at the side here. I see another triangle and it's yellow. Oh, and look, there's some blue. <gasps> Do you know what shape this is? Yeah, it's a rectangle and it's red. Wow, whoa, this half circle kind of looks like a rainbow and it's yellow on the side, one of my favorite colors. <laughs> oh, look at this little green circle. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> wow, two more giant crowns. Green and orange. Wow, it's so neat. I wonder what they're for. Oh, look at this big circle. It reminds me of a big donut. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> wow. Wait a second. I get it. It's an obstacle course. But we will need to practice and move our bodies and warm up to do an obstacle course like this. Gymnasts need to warm up and be really flexible so that they can move their bodies easily and not get hurt. <laughs> I see a gymnast over there. Let's go say hi. 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 
Hi. I'm Coach Kelsey. Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, Mika. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Do you work here? I do. I coach preschool gymnastics here. Whoa, a gymnastics coach? That means she knows a lot about gymnastics. <laughs> Would you like to get a lesson today? Yes, please. All right, let's do it. Awesome. Come on, let's go. Yes, I'm so excited to learn today. I'm excited to teach you. Now we gotta get ready, so we have to make sure that nothing's in the way. Oh. Do you think you can take off your bag? <laughs> yeah, good idea. All right, all right. We're gonna warm up our body so we feel good to get ready for gymnastics. Okay, can't wait. Do you think you can run like a tiger, fast like a tiger? Oh yeah, I know what a tiger is. Can you be fast like a tiger too? Hurrah! Hurrah! Here we go! Whoa! <laughs> that was awesome! Thank you! All right, we're gonna jump now like a kangaroo! Oh, okay, jump like a kangaroo! Whoa, this is fun! Nice, okay, can you guess what I am? Roar! Whoa, on all fours and growling. Are you a bear? I am a bear! Oh, cool! <laughs> okay, let's see. Roar! Awesome, let's turn around. Whoa! Nice job. <laughs> All right, we're pretty warmed up. Let's get to stretching. Okay. All right, we're gonna be really, really big. Whoa. Big, like a hippopotamus. <laughs> you're more flexible than me because you're a real gymnast. I've been practicing. <laughs> this is our straddle shape. Okay. Can you try to like a trunk? Can you move your hands like this? Oh, like an elephant. <laughs> All right, we're gonna put our feet together. Get nice and small. This is our squat. All right, we're gonna go one, two, three, and pop down. One, two, three. This is our pike. Raise up high. Okay. And touch your toes. Whoa. Nice. Oh, it feels really good to stretch. And you can go a little bit further. Nice shape. All right, we're gonna get into our tuck. Okay. All right, hug it like a teddy bear. Get a little rock and roll. When I count to three, we'll do another blast, okay? Ooh, a blast, okay. One, two, three, blast. Blast. There's our pie. Nice. All right, let's get our hands behind us. Okay. We're gonna bend our knees, and we're gonna push up our belly. You feeling flexible? Yeah. This is our tabletop. Oh, yeah, it's like I'm a little coffee table. Yeah, can you wave? Hello. Hello. <laughs> All right. Let's do one more shape. This is our hollow. Hollow? Hollow. <laughs> and you point your gymnastics toes. Boy, it tastes so hard. And then you turn it right into our arch shape, like a seal. Our back is an arch. Oh, that feels good. Ar, ar, ar. All right, we're pretty, we're pretty um, stretched out. Yeah, you ready I for our lesson that. now? Yeah. All right, let's have gymnastics hands oh. on. And let's go. Let's go. <laughs> All right, we got our wall here. We're gonna do some handstands. Handstands on a wall? On a wall, so oh. we can be upside down. Whoa, it's really fun to be upside down. <laughs> like a monkey, okay. Yeah. <laughs> My little guys, we call these wall walkers. Okay. Did you bring your muscles today? <laughs> oh, I right. did. We gotta push the ground and we gotta stay off our head. Okay. So we're gonna hold ourselves up and we're gonna walk the wall as far as you can. Whoa. Right. <laughs> Let's count to three. Okay. One, two, two three. three. Safely put your feet down. You did Whoa, it! Oh, that was fun! All right, let's learn another handstand. Okay. So we're gonna learn our lunge shape, one Good. foot in front a little bit, and we're going to kind of raise our hands, lift our tail, like okay. an animal tail. We reach, 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 and here comes your pop! Whoa, okay. Pop! There oh, it is! No, no, I did it! <laughs> Good handstand! Thank you! And don't forget to say ta-da! Ta-da! I love it. Okay, in gymnastics, we use a springboard, so we have to learn how to run fast. A springboard? What's that? It helps you jump. So at the end of this, I'm gonna show you how we just jump really big and reach up high. Okay, yeah, show me. <laughs> All right, here's our tigers. Okay. So we wanna run fast. We wanna jump and reach up Whoa, high. That looks so fun. Your turn. Okay, ready? <laughs> run on the tiger. Jump. Oh, Ta-da! That was fast. <laughs> Thank you. That was really cool. 
Do you know what animal this is? Oh yeah, that's an elephant. <laughs> so cute. Good job. Okay, elephants like to march. So oh. we're gonna march, march, march. And we're ready to do a cartwheel. Oh, on a block? Yeah, do you see the hands? Yeah, that must be where I would put my hands. Yeah, so what I do is I start that lunge again. Uh -huh. I kind of pat my foot, because that's the one I want to reach for. Okay. And then we're going to be like a big old, big old wings, like, like a bird. Wow. So fly over. Oh, did you see that? Cartwheels are my favorite. I do them all the time. <laughs> but this is the first time I've done one on a block before. There you go. Here we go. Whoa, that was awesome. <laughs> nice cartwheel. Thank you. All right, you've done some stuff on the floor mm -hmm. in gymnastics. We also do stuff on bars. So let's go check out the bars. Oh, come on. I'm just gonna climb up here. Wow. I'm gonna get super tall like a giraffe. I'm gonna swing. This is called casting. Casting. And once I'm ready, I'm gonna tuck my chin, turn my hands like a motorcycle, and roll. <gasps> Just Whoa, like that. Did you see that? She did a flip around the bar. Oh, okay. I want to try I now. Think you're ready. Okay. Okay. So I climb up on the bars like this, and then I hold myself up, and whoo, I'm casting. Whoo. You're doing good. <laughs> okay, now what? You're gonna tuck your chin. You're gonna turn your hands okay. like a motorcycle and okay. roll. Whoa. Nice, you went upside down. I did. I did the flip around the bar too. <laughs> so we've done bars, we did some gymnastics on the floor. How about jumping on a trampoline? <gasps> yes, I love jumping on a trampoline. All right, let's do it. All right, come on. Whoa. <gasps> wow, this is a really long trampoline. Yeah, we're gonna jump on it. Okay. <laughs> All right, we're gonna jump over something. Ooh, over what? We call them fries. Fries, I love eating fries. <laughs> All right. We got yellow. Oh. Blue. Oh. And orange. They do look like fries. Look, it's like a giant fry. <gasps> <Ooh>. Yum. <laughs> okay. All right, let's reach up like you're getting the bananas. Okay. And jump over the fries. And I want you to make sure you stop at the end so you can control your body. Okay, All ready? Right, go for it. Here we go. One, two, three. Good stop. <laughs> Thank you. All right, you'll just come back on the red. Hey. Okay. All right, that was a great jump. I'm gonna move these fries out of the way now. All right. Ooh, I wonder what's next. <laughs> All right, we're gonna be like an alligator, a chomping alligator. Oh, an alligator like this? Chomp, chomp, chomp. We gotta go big. Say straddle. Okay, straddle. Ooh. Nice. And the more you practice, you can get bigger and bigger at those straddles. Oh, gotcha. You're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna jump all the way down and make sure you stop. Okay. And come back on the red. So my arms will chomp. This way for an alligator chomp. Yeah, reach up high and then our legs will be open shut. Whoa. Okay, here I go. Ready? Jump, jump, jump. So we did some cartwheels, some handstands, some jumping. So I think you're ready to do the obstacle course. Really? Yeah, I added a few more things for you to try, but it'll oh, be a lot of fun. Oh, cool. Well, thank you so much for teaching me gymnastics today. Oh, you're welcome. Well, I'll see you nice next time. You. <laughs> Bye. Bye, nice meeting you. Yes, I can't believe she said I'm ready to do the obstacle course all by myself. Oh, and I wonder what surprises she put in there for me. All right, first things first, balance. Whoa. <gasps> hey, I remember that block. We used that block when we practiced our cartwheels. Get ready. <gasps> Whoa. <laughs> Ooh, and I can do a somersault down this triangle. I know how to do those. <laughs> Back at the half circle. Climb over. <gasps> and the green circle, I could do a kangaroo hop. <laughs> <laughs> okay, climb up and oh, the bar. Remember how we learned how to go on the bar? 
hold ourselves up and casting, casting. Then <gasps> I can go under and bear walk. <laughs> okay, and more balancing. I got this, I got this, I got this. Ta-da! <laughs> well, I did the whole thing all by myself. Ooh, there's the tiger mat. Let's run away. I am ready to go. Wow, I had so much fun learning gymnastics today at Spokane Gymnastics in Spokane Valley, Washington. We learned so many things today, like how to warm up our bodies and get flexible and strong. Ooh, it's really important that you have really good balance when you're a gymnast. Wow, we even did the bars. I've never been on bars before. Oh, and the trampoline. And then in the end, I got to do the obstacle course. Oh yeah, and I finished it all by myself. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika, good job. All right, I'll see you next time. Thanks for learning with me. Bye. Whoa. <laughs> hey, it's me, Mika. And today I'm visiting Hack Peak in Southgate, California. Did you know this is a place where we can rock climb? <laughs> yeah, rock climbing is a fun way to exercise our bodies. I have an idea. Let's play a game. Every time I make it all the way to the tippy top, I'm gonna get a Mika point. <laughs> Doesn't that sound fun? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Wow, check out all these climbing towers. <gasps> oh, before we start climbing, we should stretch and warm up our bodies. Stretching is a great way to keep your muscles healthy and safe. Okay, starting with those legs. Ah, deep breaths. Ah. <gasps> Do you hear that? I just got a Mika point for stretching. Ah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, before I climb, I should take off my jam pack. Okay, I'm ready. Oh, hey, I'm Mika, nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Bertha, nice to meet you. <laughs> did you just climb all the way to the top? Yes, I did. Oh, wow, can you show me how to get ready to climb? Yeah, of course. Awesome. <laughs> What's the first step? Thank you. Okay, so the first step, I have to get a harness on you, just for your own safety, okay? Oh, great. We're gonna get a harness on so we can be safe while we climb. Okay, so once you're ready, you're gonna put your right foot and left foot in the small holes and then just pick it up like their pants, okay? Oh, great. Right foot, left foot. Pick them up like their pants. Good job. And you're gonna hold it on your waist. Thank you. Get in it. Okay, you can let go. Great, I feel really secure. All right, you're good. Okay, and now the next step, you're gonna get your wheel and you're gonna put it in here, okay? Got my wheel. Hear the click, and then you get your key, and then sh take it right out. Release the key. There you go. <gasps> Great. And then just let your mat come down, and then you're good to go. Thank you so much, Bertha. Yeah, of course. Bye. <laughs> okay, my harness is on, and I'm locked into the belay, and I'm ready to go, because I'm safe and ready. <laughs> Are you ready? Come on, let's climb. using the muscles in my legs and my arms. <laughs> Great job. Wow, another Mika point. 
It was so cool. I can't wait to climb another wall. But first, we have to get out of our wheel. Pick up the key. Wait for the click. There it is. And release our wheel. Woo! <laughs> Great. Are you ready for our next wall? Me too. Let's go. <gasps> Look, we're at our next wall. But first, let's stretch again. All right. Here's how I stretch my legs. Yeah. And here's how I stretch my arms. Whoa. <laughs> stretch out my toesies too. And don't forget those ears. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> All right. I'm ready. Take my wheel, click, and release the key. I'm ready to go. <laughs> Whoa, don't these look like eggs? <laughs> All right, here I go. Wow, another Mika point. Whoa, I made it all the way to the top by taking it one step at a time. <sighs> all that climbing has made me kind of tired. I think now's a great time for a water break. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right, let's put in our key. Click. Grab our wheel. <sighs> let's go. I'm having so much fun climbing walls with you, but I'm feeling a little thirsty. Good thing I brought my water bottle. More Mika points, yeah. Whoa, did I just get another Mika point for drinking water? <laughs> Great. <sighs> climbing up high is a lot of fun, but it's important to drink water after you play. That's called staying hydrated, and it's really good for your body. Okay, now that I'm hydrated, I'm ready to climb the coolest wall ever. Are you ready? Great, let's go. to our next wall. Oh, and it's icy and so chilly. It's Mount Everest and it's really, really cold. Warm up your hands with me. Oh, I know. Let's dance it out to warm up our bodies. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, I'm ready. Let's buckle in and head up the mountain. Mika Point, here I come. It was cold, but I had a lot of fun. I saw so many polar bears at the top. And I earned a Mika point. And we got a Mika point. You know what else I earned? <gasps> Some hot cocoa. Ooh, nice and warm. Mmm. Now let's go see what other fun things we can do. Surprise! Here I am. <laughs> oh, check out these blocks. I want to stack them. Yellow and then blue. Oh, let's do another yellow and another blue. Whoa, cool pattern. A pattern is something that repeats itself. See? Blue, yellow, 
blue, yellow. Let's put another yellow one on top. Whoa, it's getting so high. Another blue at the very top. Whoa, Whoa I got it, cool. <laughs> Let's see if we can put another yellow one on top. Okay, here I go. Whoa! Awesome! That was so much fun! Let's find another wall to climb. Whoa! This wall is awesome! It looks like seven bouncy balls stacked on top of each other. One, two, three, four, This is going to be the most challenging climb yet. Challenging means it's going to take a little bit more effort than before, but I'm up for the challenge. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get a Mika point for every ball I climb on. That's going to be a lot of Mika points. You ready? <laughs> Me too. All right, put our wheel in, click, and release the key. Make a point, here I come. Put in my key. Release the wheel. That was so much fun. It was challenging, but we made it all the way to the top. Great job. <laughs> Hooray. <laughs> wow, today was awesome. First, we stretched our bodies and warmed up. Then Bertha showed us how to put on a harness so we could safely climb our first wall. <gasps> we had hot cocoa on top of Mount Everest. Then we finished with a grand finale on the seven bouncy balls and earned lots of Mika points. You helped me earn this many Mika points today. <laughs> Whoa, we make such a great team. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? Great. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. Okay, see you later. It's me, Mika. And today we're at Posh and Petite Playhouse in Woodland Hills, California. <laughs> Did you know this is a place where we can explore and be curious about different jobs? <laughs> I can't wait to try different jobs like an ice cream maker or a firefighter. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Which way should we go? Oh, check out this road. <laughs> Look, it's black with white stripes. Oh, black and white are opposite colors. Opposites mean they're completely different from one another. Kind of like, oh, night and day or hot and cold. <laughs> oh, check it out. Do you see that horse over there? Oh, let's drive our car over to him. Hello, horsey! <laughs> I'm gonna name him Popsicle, cause I really love Popsicle. <laughs> Can you pretend to be a horse? <gasps> Nay! Whoa! Oh, he's got a lot of horsepower. Let's go! <laughs> Check it out, it's a marketplace. We can buy healthy fruits and vegetables here and make delicious meals. I know, let's be a grocer. <laughs> All right, see you later, Popsicle. First, we need our basket. <laughs> wow, check it out. If we wanna be a grocer, we have to get some items to put in our basket so we can ring it up. 
First, we'll need some alphabet soup. That's healthy and delicious. And how about some peas and carrots? And, ooh, mushrooms too. Check out all these healthy fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables are good for your body because they help you grow strong. <laughs> I got it. Let's play a game. Fruit or vegetable? A carrot. It's orange and crunchy and bunny rabbits love to eat them. Mmm, tasty. <laughs> Do you know if this is a fruit or a vegetable? Oh, that's right, a vegetable. Great job. All right, how about this? It's a cucumber. It's green and it has seeds. Fruits have seeds and vegetables don't. Fruit or vegetable? <laughs> oh yeah, that's a tricky one. It's a fruit, even though it seems like it's a vegetable. But great job. Hmm. Oh, yum. A strawberry. Strawberries are really, really sweet. Is a strawberry a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> awesome. A fruit. One fruit point, please. Hmm. Oh, look. A lemon. Lemons are one of my favorite colors. Yellow. And they're really sour. Can you pretend to taste a sour lemon? <laughs> Whoa! Oh, sour is the opposite of sweet. Strawberries are sweet, but lemons are sour. Is this a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a fruit, just like the sweet strawberry. Okay, ooh, check it out, a piece of corn. <gasps> Mmm, that's delicious. Do you know if it's a fruit or a vegetable? <laughs> right, a yummy vegetable. All right, let's go check out now. Welcome to Mika's Marketplace. Oh, I see you got corn. And you're in luck, because we have a special on corn. Just one cent. And a lemon and our sweet strawberry, and a delicious carrot, and alphabet soup, peas and carrots, mmm, mushrooms. Wow, you got so many healthy options. <laughs> oh, being a grocer is so much fun. We even got to help a customer take home delicious vegetables to make yummy meals. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Yeehaw! Hey, we're at an ice cream shop. I know, let's pretend to be ice cream makers. I scream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Let's go! Welcome to Mika's Magical Ice Cream Parlor. What's that? Fresh baked cookies? <laughs> Coming right up. Look at that. Fresh out the oven. Oh, they smell delicious. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 12 crispy cookies. Let's taste one. Mmm, that's delicious. Would you like a bite? <laughs> there you go. Mmm, <laughs> do you know what this is? That's right, a purple popsicle, just like my horse's name. <laughs> Would you like a popsicle? There you are, one for you and one for me. Oh, that's really cold. Perfect for a hot day. Oh, those are opposites, hot and cold. When I'm cold, oh, it makes me shiver. But when I'm hot, oh, I could sure use a popsicle. <laughs> Would you like some ice cream today? Great. 
How many scoops? <laughs> Five scoops? Okay, here we go. <laughs> One chocolate scoop. <laughs> Two, a vanilla scoop. Three, mint chocolate chip. <laughs> there you go, friend. Perfect. Four, a strawberry scoop. And five, a vanilla scoop on top. <laughs> wow, it's stacked up so high. <laughs> I love being an ice cream maker. I love scooping ice cream and tasting it too. Hey, I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> okay, let's see what other jobs we can do. <gasps> Hello, Popsicle. Are you ready? Are you set? Go! <gasps> wow, check it out. We're in front of a fire station. A firefighter's job is to put out fires. Do you want to be a firefighter with me? <laughs> awesome, let's go. This is a cool fire station. Oh, look, a fire truck. It's red and really long too. <laughs> and look at these trucks. Let's go park. All right, to the parking lot we go. <laughs> Oh, and look at these trucks. They're really big. Oh, and these trucks are small. Big and small, those are opposites. How about this one? Big or small compared to this truck? Pretty small, right? <laughs> but what about compared to this one? Oh, now it's really big. <laughs> Do you hear that? It's a siren. Oh, we gotta get ready to go. Put out a fire. Hello? Yes, fire? On one, two, three, fire road? Oh no, let's go. Grab our hose. Firefighter Mika is on the way. Grab my hose and save the day. We just put out a fire. Oh, <laughs> that was so much fun. Thanks for helping me. You're very brave. Firefighters are really brave. <laughs> Let's go see what other jobs we can do. Whoa, look, an animal hospital. This is where veterinarians work. Veterinarians are doctors, but for animals. Would you like to be a veterinarian with me? <laughs> awesome, let's go. Oh, look at these doors. A small door for turtles and hamsters and gerbils too, and a medium door for bunny rabbits and ducks, quack quack, and ferrets and guinea pigs too. And a large door for cats and dogs. Large and small, those are opposites. <laughs> cool. Oh, and look at this door for birdies. Oh, that's another opposite. High and low, low and high. <laughs> Let's pretend to be birds, fly into the vet's office. Tweet, 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 tweet. <laughs> oh, do you hear that? Paging Dr. Mika, you have a patient ready. Okay. Oh, and check it out. Here's our patient. Hello, puppy. How are you today? Little scratches, scratches. Did your family bring you here for a checkup? Oh, awesome. All right, let's get started, boy. We have a stethoscope. Stethoscopes are for hearing what's inside of your body, like your heart. Oh, may I check your heart too? Great. Wow, that sounds
nails nice and strong. Okay, let's check Puppy's heart. This might be a little cold. <gasps> wow, that sounds so healthy and strong. You must be getting on your daily walks, huh? Don't forget to hydrate, okay? Doctor's orders. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, being a veterinarian is so much fun. I love helping animals and their families, too. <laughs> now that I checked out the whole town, I'm going to hit the road. Are you ready, Popsicle? <laughs> Let's go! Giddy up! <laughs> Thank you so much for exploring different jobs with me today. <laughs> if I had to choose, I'd be a ice cream maker, grocer, animal doctor, firefighter. <laughs> all at once. <laughs> they were all so much fun, I can't just pick one. <laughs> but you know the best part? Exploring with you, friend. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Can you spell my name with me? Oh, great! M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika! <laughs> okay, friends, see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs> hey, it's me, Mika. And today, I'm at Triple Play Family Fun Park in Hayden, Idaho. Oh, I'm so excited to be here. <gasps> What's that sound? Oh my goodness, look, it's a dinosaur. Whoa, are you a velociraptor? Whoa, wait, I heard about you. Are you Stanley? <laughs> Can you show me some fun things to do inside triple play? <laughs> awesome, come on. <gasps> Whoa, there's water. Yeah, oh, Stanley, you know those dinosaurs over there? Ah, oh, hi, I'm Mika. <laughs> Whoa, Stanley, you're so nice to show me around. I love dinosaurs. <gasps> we should all act like dinosaurs. Can you help us? Okay, awesome. What's something a dinosaur does? Oh yeah, stop, stop. Stomp, stomp like a dinosaur. Ooh, what's something else dinosaurs do? Oh yeah, they have really big and mighty roars. Let's roar together, ready? Roar! Whoa, Stanley, I don't know if I could roar as loud as you. <laughs> what's something else that dinosaurs do? What, dinosaurs dance? I didn't know that. Let's all dance together. Yeah, you got the move, Stanley. Okay, all right. <laughs> Aw, it was so nice meeting you, Stanley. Thanks for showing us how to be dinosaurs and taking us to this really cool space. I'll see you next time, buddy. Bye. <gasps> Whoa, did you see how big his tail is? Stanley's so cool. I wonder what else is in here. Whoa! This place is really cool. I've never been in a space like this before. There's a huge pool. Whoa! Look at this. It's a raft. Do you know what shape this is? It's a circle. <laughs> and do you know what color it is? That's right, it's the color red. Good color. Alrighty, oh. <gasps> Let's get a closer look at Stanley's friends. Come on. Okay, let's sneak up on Stanley's friends. Hello. <laughs> oh, hi, nice to meet you. My name is Mika. Look, can you see their teeth? They have way more teeth than we do. And they're so, so sharp. They're carnivores. That means they like to eat meat. Whoa. These are velociraptors. And they run really, really fast on their legs. 
Whoa, look how big and sharp that talon is. Whoa, can you imagine if you had those on your toes? <laughs> it would be really hard to wear sneakers if your toenails were like that. <laughs> Let's keep exploring. Whoa! Look at this! It's like a water playground. They call it the Children's Lagoon here. Oh! Look at that yellow slide! That would be so fun because you can land in the water and get all wet. <laughs> wow! Whoa! See how the floor is painted different colors? I see yellow. There's blue. Oh, and all the way back there is red. It makes the water look like it's different colors. <laughs> Whoa, looks like you can walk up a net, go up the yellow stairs, and there's more water slides. This place is so cool. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, there's another fountain. Wow. There's water all over this. I think you would need a swimsuit to play on that playground. <laughs> Whoa, look over here. Dinosaur footprints. Whoa, do you think Stanley made those or another dinosaur? Hmm. Oh, here's another one. Whoa, look how much bigger it is than my foot. Whoa. Wow. Oh, oh, come here. Wow. This is an actual mold of a real dinosaur fossil. Do you know what kind of dinosaur it is? It's a velociraptor. <laughs> We've seen a lot of those today. Whoa. Look at its mouth. You can see its sharp teeth in there. Velociraptors lived 150 million years ago. <laughs> Whoa. Is it snack? These are the ribs. We have ribs on our sides. <laughs> wow. Whoa, look at the tail. Even the tail has bones in it. Wow. <laughs> Velociraptors are really cool and really ferocious and strong and super fast. Whoa! <laughs> More dinosaur footprints! Let's see where they take us! Oh! Look at this! A crate of objects! Hmm! And we're by a giant pool! <gasps> that only means one thing! We should play Sink or Float! <laughs> Will you play sink or float with me? Awesome, let's do it. All right, let's see what we have in the crate. We have a blue bouncy ball. Ooh. <laughs> will it sink or will it float? We won't know until we throw. It's floating. <laughs> and we have a, ooh, a spatula. Maybe you've seen these in your kitchen. Can make pancakes. Ooh, do you think it will sink or float? Let's see. Whoa, it went to the bottom, but the handle is sticking up. It sunk. All right, will it sink or will it float? Wow, this is a really cool cup. I love these colors. <gasps> Oh, I love it. But will it sink or float? Oh, it floats. Okay, what else do we have in here? Oh, here's a fun truck. Vroom, 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 vroom. Oh, nice and yellow. One of my favorite colors. Huh. I wonder if this will sink or float. Only one way to find out. <laughs> Whoa, look at these. Hello. Whoa, I can see you way clearer now. <laughs> Let's see, 
Will these silly glasses sink or float? It looks like they're sinking, wow. I totally thought they were going to float. <laughs> All right, what else is in here? Oh yeah, another Velociraptor. <laughs> will you sink or will you float? We won't know until we throw. That dinosaur is definitely floating. All right, hmm. Whoa, hey, this is a ruler. You can use it to measure things. I wonder if it will sink or float. Ooh. It's sinking. <laughs> wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. Should we see if the rest will sink or float and one big dump? <laughs> Let's do it. One, two, three, woo! Whoa! Wow! I see some diving sticks that sunk to the bottom and everything else is floating away. Goodbye! Ha. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> awesome! Let's spell it in the pool. Okay, ready? M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> well, thank you so much for having a good time with me today in this super cool place filled with velociraptors. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs> Hi, it's me, Mika. And today I'm at O2B Kids in Orlando, Florida. This place is really fun. They have games, they have dance classes, and I want to learn some new dance moves. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, Mika. I'm Trudy. Welcome to O2B Kids, the new learning playground. Oh, thank you so much. So I want to learn some new dance moves today. Mr. Christian is available for a dance lesson right now. Really? Where is it? You can head to the theater. Oh, let's go to the theater. <laughs> This is it, the theater. Oh, let's go inside. Whoa! <laughs> Amazing dance moves! Thank you. Hi, I'm Mika. Hi, I'm Mr. Christian. I'm the dance teacher here. Wow, a dance teacher? Could you give me a dance lesson? Sure, but first, what moves do you want to learn? Oh, I want to learn a hip hop move, a break dance move, and a ballet move. Awesome, awesome. But first, before we do that, we have to go warm up and stretch, okay? Oh yeah, makes sense. Where do we do that? Follow me. Oh, okay. Follow Mr. Christian. Oh, I'm so excited to get started. Me too. All right, first, we're going to warm up. Oh, it's so important to warm up your body before you dance, get your muscles loose and warmed up so you don't get hurt. Absolutely. All right, so first, we're going to run in place and count to eight. Oh, yeah. You count to eight in dance because you can easily break up the sections in music when you're learning dance moves. And you don't have to count too high. Absolutely. All right, ready? Okay. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 Stop. Oh. <laughs> I'm already awesome. warming up. Awesome. All right, so next thing, we're gonna do our pizza stretch, okay? I love pizza. Me too. Okay? Okay. So we gotta go into our straddle. We're gonna sit on the ground. We're gonna go into our straddle. We're okay. gonna spread our legs out. All right, you can sit on the ground too. All right, and we're going to roll our dough out. So we're gonna roll our dough. And we're going to pat, 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 all around. Pat, 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 pat. There you go. And then we're going to pour our sauce all around. Ooh. And then we're gonna spread our sauce, spread our sauce. Awesome, awesome. And then we're going to sprinkle our cheese. Ooh. Sprinkle our and cheese. if you're dairy free, you can use dairy free cheese. Cheese with no dairy. There you go. And then we're going to put our toppings. Ooh. I'm gonna put chicken on mine because I okay, love chicken. Okay, I'm gonna put some mushrooms and ooh, green pepper. Ooh, I'm gonna put some pineapples on ooh. there. Mm -hmm. That sounds yummy. Yeah. All right, and then we're going to put our other mittens on. Yep, okay. mm -hmm. protect ourselves. Mm -hmm. 
and then we're going to take the pizza, we're going to put it in the oven. So we're going to open the oven door. We're going to put the pizza in there. We're going to close the door. And then we're going to count to eight. Okay. Ready? We're going to go one, two, two three, four, four, five, six, six seven, seven, eight. Ding, 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 ding. It's ready. Fast cooking pizza. Yeah. So we're going to take it out, open the door. Take out the pizza. All right, ready? And three, two, one. No, 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 we're gonna count yeah. to eight. One, One two, two, three, four, four five, five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Yay! Wow. I feel really good now and warmed up. Awesome. I'm well, ready to dance. You ready? Let's mm -hmm. go. Okay, come on, let's go learn some dance moves. Whoa! We are in a real dance studio. This is awesome. I can't believe you are gonna teach me hip hop moves break dance moves, and ballet moves. You know a lot about dance. What do you love most about it? There's just so many things about dance I love, but a few things that I love are that I can use one side of my mind, which is the logic side, and the other side of my mind, which is the creative side, and put them together through my movements. Also that it's a form of self-expression. Oh, yeah. So you can really express yourself through the movements. And also, it's a sense of community. It's really about love and sharing that with everyone. Oh, that's so cool. I also like to express myself through music and dance. It's such a fun way to just be yourself and let loose and have fun. Yeah. <laughs> and you especially do that in hip hop, right? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Oh, what are the hip hop moves we're gonna learn? Okay, so our first move is our step touch, step touch. Okay. And when we do that, we're gonna count to eight, okay? Oh you yeah, ready? count to eight, I remember. All right, so first, we gotta step out with our right foot. Okay. One, and step together, two. Mm -hmm. And step out with your left, one. Step together, two. Oh, and then repeat step, that. Yep. Touch. I did. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> step touch. Okay. So we're gonna do that a little faster. Okay. Okay. Ready? Yep. Five, six, seven, eight. One, One two, two, three, four, five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Good job. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> awesome. All right. So next, we're gonna do the same thing. Okay. But we're gonna add arms to make it look really cool. Whoa. You ready? Okay. All right. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, two three, four, four, five, six, six seven, seven, eight. eight. Good job. Wow, that did look yeah. cool. <laughs> awesome. All right, so after that, we're gonna do our top rock. And oh. our top rock is a really cool move because it's the basic move for break dancing. Okay, so we are learning a basic move of break dance. So yeah. awesome. <laughs> okay, so first, you're gonna take your right arm. Okay. So right hand over and then your left hand under, Ooh. okay? Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna step out with your right foot, then okay. your heels gonna point up to the sky, and then our arms are gonna go out like you're about to give a big hug. Oh yeah, big yeah. hug! Okay, and then we're gonna repeat it to the other side. We're gonna step out with the right, we're gonna, put, we're gonna switch our hands over, left over, right under, and then we're gonna kick out with our left foot, and our toes point up at the sky again, and we're gonna make a big hug one more time. Ah, Ooh, big hug. There you go. Good job. Nice. You think we can do a little faster? Yeah, let's try All it. Right. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, two three, four, five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Yes, oh, good so job. Fun. Thank yeah. you. All right, and our next move to make a little more flavor and Ooh, put our fruit on it, yes. we're going to do a crisscross. Criss you ready? Crisscross, what's that? Okay. So it's pretty, pretty simple, okay? So your feet are kind of shoulder width apart. Okay. And think of it like a scissor, okay? okay. You're like you're chopping paper, okay? You go, so you're gonna go cross with your right over your left. I know it's a little confusing, but we'll go through very slow, okay? okay. We're gonna go right foot, and we're gonna cross. Oh, it is like yeah. scissors, like and you're cutting yeah. paper. Exactly. And then we're gonna switch it to switch feet. So you're gonna go left or right, ready? Mm -hmm. Five, six, seven, eight, two, two. 
And switch. Yeah, there you go. Do a little faster. Okay. All right, ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, two, two. Yes, <laughs> good job. Thank you. That's awesome. All right, after that, we're gonna move into our ballet. Oh yeah, I really love that ballet. Yeah. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put our feet together. Okay. Okay. And we're gonna put our heels turned out. Okay, you see your toes or heels or kissing each other and going okay. mwah. Awesome. And we're gonna put our arms into our beach ball like this. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And we're gonna count, we're gonna count to eight one more time. So we're gonna go one, two, two three, four, four five, five, six, six seven, seven, eight. eight. Good job. Okay. Awesome. And that is called our plie. Oh, and that means to bend in French. There you go. So we're gonna do it just a little bit faster. Is that okay? Okay. All right. Five, six, seven, eight. One, One two, two, three, four, four five, six, six, seven, eight. eight. Good job. Great. Thank you. Awesome. Okay. And then to add a little more spice flavor to Love our it. ballet, uh -huh. we're gonna do some tendus, okay? Oh, and tendu means to stretch in French. There you go. So we're gonna do our tendus to the side. We're gonna start on our right side. We're gonna do it four times. And we're gonna go one with our right toe out. Uh -huh. And we're just gonna bring it. One more time. Out. Bring it. Out. Out. Bring it. Out. Out. In. In. Good job. Thank you. You're welcome. And now we're going to go to the other side, okay? Okay. So our hands are still on your hips like this. Mm -hmm. And you're going to go out with your left foot. Out. And then bring it. And you're going to go out. Out. And bring it. In. And you're going to go out. Bring it. Out. Bring it. Oh, Good job. Thank you. Wow. Can we do a little faster? Yeah, let's try right. it. Ready? Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yay! Good job! Thank you for teaching me all of those moves. Of course, of course. Are you ready to put it all together? I think so. All right. It's going to be a little faster. It might be a little challenging, but I think we can do it. I think so, too. All right, you ready? Yep. All right, we're going to start with the step touch. You ready? Yes. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Arms. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Top row. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Criss cross. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Criss cross. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Plie. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Time to two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. Oh, I have an idea. Okay. After that, can we freestyle and express ourselves however we want? Absolutely. That's the point of dance. Absolutely. Oh, awesome. I think I'm ready to do a performance. <gasps> I'm so excited. I can't wait. Okay. All right. Let's do let's it. Let's do it. Okay. Let's do it. You lead the way. All right. Let's go. <laughs> Come on. Introducing the wonderful, talented, and unique Mika. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Hello. My name is Mika. Yeah. It's nice to meet ya. Hey. I'm quite a thinker. That's me. And I like to tinker. Come on. My name is Mika. Yeah. It's nice to meet ya. Hey. I'm quite a thinker. That's me. And I like to tinker. Come on. Well, you know. Oh my gosh, that was so good. Oh, thank you for teaching me all of those new dance moves. Of course, it's my pleasure. Oh, you're a great teacher. Oh, thanks. Well, I'll see you later. All right, thanks, Mr. Christian. You're see welcome. ya. Bye. Wow, we had so much fun today and really learned a lot. We learned about warming up our bodies and staying loose when we learn new dance moves. And speaking of dance moves, we learned new hip-hop moves, 
break dance moves, and ballet moves. And we did a great job counting to eight. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <sighs> awesome. M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. All right, we'll see you next time. Keep dancing. <laughs> Come on, everyone. Let's make a learning fun. Mika, Mika. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout Mika. Mika.